Essen Spiel 2018. The fate of the Dice Tower's Essen Hall of Games is sealed by the loud kiss of packing tape. The games travel like kittens snuggled in cardboard boxes and embark on a voyage across the sea driven by the desires of receiving perhaps an exclaimed yes of approval from Sam Healy or perhaps a Jason Levine squee of excitement. The anticipation weighed heavily on the Dice Tower and some wondered if the games would ever arrive. Weeks pass. Another convention. A cruise. And then finally, they arrived. Eighteen boxes bruised and battered with the trials and tests of a journey of ordeals no tracking number could convey. And now, they are home. They are home. So, let's open these bad boys up. Hey everybody, I'm Tom Vassell. I'm Z Garcia, hello! Sam Healy, welcome folks. And special guest, Jason Levine, the gaming machine. I don't think you're actually supposed to say <laughs> I don't think you're supposed to call yourself a special guest. But you know, welcome, welcome. Jason Hurt, we were opening games, and this is a, dip, a new experience, because he doesn't open his own, so he's going to help us open ours. <laughs> yeah. Well, well, the good thing is, as you pass them along, I can decide which ones I like, and then store them in a separate pile for myself. We'll probably let you take them. <laughs> There's a lot here. All right, so on the, on the screen it says SN Unboxing 2019. That's because we're recording this on January 21st, 2019. The games are that's actually all not, produced in 2018. That's how long it took for them to get here, yes. It did, to the point where if you made me sit down and write a list of the games in these boxes, I might get five. I, had, I don't think I'd get that many. I don't recall what's in there. And I know I, there's one. We were packing them, and I still uh, I know which one you're thinking of. I know there's does one. start with an R? Yes, it does. <laughs> uh, I could probably that one's name. not going to make it all the way to that stack over there. It's going to make it to this stack right here. Uh, I think I could probably name at least 100 of them, but maybe that's because I was the one running around picking them all up, so I okay, kind of remember what we got. There may be things in here that aren't games. We haven't looked. With the boxes are slit, that's about it. So... This, we're going to do this until we're done, or until our Kickstarter funds. Whichever one comes first. <laughs> Whichever yeah. one comes first. <laughs> Actually, we, it, no, we'll, it'll fund. It's like, so as soon as it funds, we're stopping? That <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're out. Done. All right. Yeah, let's not do that either. Here we go. All right, let's do it. This one is Death on the Rails in 1918, as opposed to... Why is there a slug on it? And a slug. Those are... This one's... Um, this one was produced a little before 2018, I guess. Uh, How do you it's know? It's a hundred years older than that. Uh, all right, let's see. What do we got? Oh, yeah, baby. This is going to make Jason's pile for sure. <laughs> this looks to be a, a Hex Encounter war game. Maybe? Yes. Two-player yes, game. It actually is. And, uh, Go ahead and push it on over. If not, it could be a Sam game as well. This is, I this don't is right touch up your alley, Sam. He's going to love it. What else why we would, got? Why would you Give say... That Hex Encounter is right up my alley. All right, Rocket Racket, or is it Rocket Racket? It. Rocket Racket. But I think. it's supposed to have a C. Uh, what is it? Who's Rocket the Racket person? is a card game. Two to four players, 15 minutes. I don't wow. know anything about this. It's a card game. What gave it away? <laughs> it might be a dice game. The cards on the back gave it away. It could be a dice game. No. It also has that little sticker for, like, you know. Zero to three. Zero to three. No uh, Christmas tree ornaments shaped like babies screaming. <laughs> there we go. Bam. Rocket racket. All right. So we got to, like, when one That's comes out that we game. think is, like, it's high in our tennis, interest, we need to mention that, right? So, okay, so far, all the so ones we're looking at are low. okay. Low. There's cryptocurrency. This game was worth a lot more about six months ago. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Woo! Low. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, it might be interesting. I don't know. Welcome to the new economy. Oh, my goodness. I was just thinking the exact same thing. Yeah, you and I hang out too much together is what it is. You know, the word <laughs> welcome to shouldn't always conjure that song. No, but it does. <laughs> it does. Always. <laughs> Cryptocurrency. All right, here's what I'm actually interested I'm in. I'm ready to sing Roses with Noises this. at night. It's a 20-minute deduction game. and also has gold foil on the letters. That kid's face is jacked up. That looks really good. No, I like eyes, the artwork in this. His yeah. eyes are next to his nose. Yeah, his eyes are also as big as his hands. It's a yeah, cartoon. It's okay. I remember picking this one up and going, ooh, this looks cool when I picked it up. Who's the publisher? b and b and b Games, yeah. How do we know I like them? them. What have they done? Other games. <laughs> yeah, yeah. They've definitely <laughs> been a publisher before. Well, they're like um, the little brother of I like deduction R &R. games. I like deduction games, especially that try to do something small like this. They're not always 
successful at pulling off deduction in a small package, but this looks cute. Yeah, this could work. Looks All right, here cute. comes the dog. Low. <laughs> <laughs> here comes the dog. Na, 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 Wait, that's the second edition. Here comes the dog, the second time, and it's still ugly. Boom, 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 boom. Actually, it's all about building a fire. It's like a, it's like a dexterity. little fire. <laughs> all, right. all right. It's all right. That was fairly correct. That, that was. That was good. Melodic, actually. Is this an oink game? You, you melodious yeah. cat. <laughs> I don't know. Oink games were this fat. Oink cats. Oh, so, so no, they, they, money they, bags. No, the size. This, this size is always the you same. The depth disinestant. changes. Oh, does it? Yeah. The yes. depth okay. changes. Yeah, money bags actually has a bunch of bags filled with coins, money. Yeah, Jason and, and I played this briefly. Oh, you did, okay. It's really weird. You're pulling money from the bag, but like <laughs> pretending you're not pulling money from the bag. Right, it's correct. Kind of like yes. the way I treat my bank account. <laughs> it's a bluffing game. Yes. <laughs> I thought so, it was. Did you like it? it? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I liked it. Tom? It's okay. Mid. That's what Jason also said off camera. All right. <laughs> Steam Pirates. Here we're talking. Now we're talking. Golden Egg. Golden Egg. Oh. Wow. That is a bad back of the box cover, though. Look at that. It's a pixelated picture. Well, you won't be able to tell on the video here, folks, but yeah, it's actually a very low res image on this. It looks like a prototype. We're sure this is not a prototype, right? Yes, we're yeah. sure. Uh, okay, the front is okay, you know. I like the, the steampunk thing. I like all of that, but. I don't know. This one's sending up a lot of red flags, unfortunately. Yeah. Yeah. We'll see. Good. This one looks cool. Oh, Kingdom this Defenders. I opened actually almost made my luggage. Really? Yeah. And is I just that because fit it. there's a soldier and his head is Cthulhu? Heck yes! <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Look at that. But he also, it looked, it looked interesting. It looked interesting. I opened it up and looked at it. It looks like a dice place. Oh, when game. I opened it, uh, this was not here. Dead tent? <laughs> Yeah. yeah why? That's why you, this is why you keep games in shrink wrap because then they don't get dented. I'm pretty sure the shrink the wrap, shrink wrap is in cement based. <laughs> it's not carbon fiber. The shrink, shrink wrap, wrap for the games in my house. Well, oh, you mow them. <laughs> this actually made my short list for anticipated games. Well, there you go. So Did high. It? We're both Did high it? on yeah. this one. Right? I'm actually. <laughs> the cover is cool. The cover I, is really cool. The I actually, I, when I saw the the cover, I don't care the about cover it much. Looks like if Cthulhu but that looks good. Warhammer 40k. No, it's Cthulhu. Um, I don't know this company. Napoleon. <laughs> it's Catholian. <laughs> sure, I was trying. I gotta look at the back of this. You did, right. it, you did it. That does look cool. Elios I, it's a Euro game. I'm surprised you guys like it. It That's looks neat. I love that. Get out of here. It's dice place we to like Euro games. Now, this is a pretty nice cover. Greenbrier. That's a good cover, yeah. It's yes. bright. It looks good, especially on oh. video there. It looks like good. Like Sean McLeod. Small pause. We hit 25% in our Kickstarter. Woo! Yes. Let the expands continue, folks. Thanks for backing us. And and, and don't yes. let our low-key thing there. I'm very excited about no, no, that. No, this is More than 25% now. Oh. How do you know? Because oh I can see. It's a oh. Oh, he'll keep us updated. Good. All right, good, good. All right, what do we got here? 30 to 5, 60 minutes, 14 and up. Greenbrier, they did that zombie game. The, the board looks cooler than the box, actually. Yeah, no, that's a, that, that, that looks good. It's a 3D rendering of it, but it looks like it could be interesting. However, there you go. All right. There we go. What do you think about this, Sam? Are you excited about it? You like that, that whole thing? I don't know. We'll see. It, Greenbrier is hit or miss for me, so... Okay. We'll see how we'll see how it goes. It's not my that is, box feels guys enjoy it. bigger right. than it needs to be. Yes. This one is on my high list, if only because it has the word Super Meeple in the corner, and they're just awesome these well, days. Well, I'm excited and about US this Telegraph. also because this is a reprint of Attica. Is it really like oh. Attica, the old game? 100. I'm percent <laughs> No, I got this. I'm 100 percent in with Z on this. Don't touch me. Attica looks amazing. <laughs> it's amazing. Oh, it is. Oh. <laughs> it is I've never seen print. someone go from so pumped. I know he's like Woo! so deflated. Oh. Although I will say the theme makes more sense because now you're connecting two sides of the board. Yeah, 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 that yeah, makes sense works, for the telegraph. No, I always I thought Attica was a fine game. Um, I will play it two player only. Two players good. Two players good. Because it has the whole thing block Z. I'm like I'm not blocking Z. You block him, yeah. Oh, yeah, they were that. gonna call this Where's Doctor Telegraph originally, but really? No, come on. <laughs> Doctor Telegraph. What? Did you ever play Attica? First Doctor Lucky, you know you have to do that. Anyway, no, this looks good, and I'm, I'm I, gotta, I haven't looked at the production itself, but I got a like clean slate on this one. Super Meeple, good stuff. Got a clean yes, slate. Cancel. Cancel. a great game. 
This guy's name is Cancel, I think. The mouse deer is a bad boy. He likes to steal cucumbers. Let's go catch him and punish him. He said it's a mouse deer? All right, let's see. Give it a chance. Oh, yeah, 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 for sure. I don't remember which size of the I got box this from. says that it's up your ear alley. Look at the eyes on this creature. Yes. Okay, what booth, yes. what company is this? I don't remember this picking this one up. This is creeping me out. All right, I don't know what this is. Fabled. I don't know where this is from. Did, did this get dropped off at the booth and I didn't pick it up? Made I don't in remember Indonesia. This. This okay, it's an Indonesian audio. game. All right. Oh, yes, I did go to the Indonesian booth. Okay, the mouse deer. What is what? That's right. It looks well, interesting. I'm I, hoping, who knows? I'm hoping it's good because I'd like to see more games coming from that part of the world. Absolutely. This is just a wild card we, right we, now. We got about no, 20 no games idea. from the Indonesian The booth, table's so lava. Ah! <laughs> you guys are hot. Too late. Uh, you you burned. You're, you're way burned, behind buddy. on that one, buddy. All right. Now, this I've seen pop up online a few more, a few times already. I did not realize it was an R&R &R game. I'm guessing a party game. Um, um, that looks like a party R &R game of some game? sort. No, they've course. done like... They've done other games. They're, they're, they did the. They've done other. What was things, the one the yeah, coal mining game that they reprinted? For times up, baby. Yeah. All right, I'll pass that along. R and R has done tons of games. Oh, you mean they they put that out yet? Yeah. R and R did <laughs> Mombasa. That's not even funny, dude. But look, look, that's Sam in green, and that's you, Tom, in red, and I believe he kicked you off. Over well, where is it? I mean, right there. Yeah. And I'm over here, down here, being like, <laughs> and I'm doing the the blue Why like. You're the just on your face, lying down snooker, your face, because you haven't snooker. slept for. You know, That's true. You're at a convention. <laughs> Speaking true. of that, he showed me his sleep times. It's for ridiculous. For the cruise, bet, yeah. One night it was two and a half hours. Jeez. I had to entertain guests. That's important. You yeah. also need to sleep. Yeah, we did. So you, that a corpse can cannot entertain, entertain guests. All right. Well, I don't know if you have a win. Now, this one we already played and reviewed, but we got it because the new expansion came out. Also, it's going in the Dice Tower Library. Oh, okay. Yep, yep. Now it's got a... Uh, did it always have the Artipia and Stronghold down here? Did the last No, printing? that's probably new. It must be a new printing thing. Looks good. Yes. What else we got? Wonderland... Wonderland? 13. Wonderland. Wonder okay, Man now version. this is singing to That me. box looks awesome. Right? Because it looks cool. Look at that. It's got a... Ooh. It's got some... Uh, what is that? Metallic ink printing. And I don't know anything else about it. Two to four players. 15 to 30 minutes. It's a little on the long side. <laughs> <laughs> oh my ah, he's, ah, he's leaning into troll -tastic. it. Troll-tastic. troll It looks cool. Alright, this game has no English, Jason. I'm hoping... Jason, how did this one get in the box? Because you asked me to pick that up. Oh, That was part of, this, of the Schmidt Spiel. That should be Schmidt Spiel, I Apply believe. Ice or and that was part of No, this is Muck Spiel, which is a, a different company. You would ask me to pick that one up. Professor Three Stein, look at the board. <laughs> look at that, man. It's that awesome. It's amazing. I don't think look I asked that. you to get that one. You, it was on the list. I wouldn't have picked it, it up. It was on the list as a possibility. Guys, what are we complaining about? This looks good. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, this looks like a, an educational it's, game, it's doesn't it? It's an educational children's game. Okay, that's what it is. Okay, then, 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 yeah, that's what it is. Now, unfortunately, if it's just in German, it, the only thing it's going to be educating us on is uh, German. Or another way to deposit it into a certain kind of receptacle. All right. Along. And I can talk oh, too, says, love this format. Thanks. Now this I'm looking forward to. This is high. That See, looks awesome. Even really? though... How did you know? I was like, no, oh, this one doesn't look... I'm Wait, can I just... Well, but, but I will say this. The other game from the publisher... Mondu. Yeah, that came out there. And the designers was the one with those bears. That for yes. me personally, what bears? bombed. I don't know what it was called. I already forgot. They had all the bears. You put the bear statues out. Yes. I don't think I played that one. Dude, you played right with me. I reviewed it. You don't watch those. Um, <laughs> it's, it was kind of like a ticket to ride. You don't ride. watch my reviews either. Of course not. Of course. Come on, man. We're busy. It's Korean. Uh, it's automatically in. Wait. Uh, this what one? was that game called? Mm -hmm. The internet will tell us because I reviewed it. You connected bear statues. And I just found it to be really basic and simple. But... This sounded good. Oh, this is a company, though, that they redid Manhattan. Yes, yes. they did redo Manhattan. And they did Wongdo. Is that the game you're talking That's about? That's it, Wongdo. Wongdo. Oh, that's the game we made fun of. 
the name. I don't remember. Oh, yeah, yes. oh, that's right. But, but this, uh, this is from also Sebastian Pauschen, who did Wando, and the same publisher, so... I like Sebastian's games. I normally do, too, but he that's the River and Wando back-to-back. Back. Yeah. Something's the going river. on. I he's think on, Uwe Rosenberg show. jumped in there, sucked out his brain matter from, for game-making, left him with just the... I don't know. Um, well, I'm scared. I, I, I want to give it a seal of approval. Uh, he's been waiting. That's been cooking for the, like the last five minutes. Here. Here's Coffee Topia. Oh, delicious. This is Indonesia's is this official a game souvenir. Because there is food in there sometimes. <laughs> no, no, but the rules have been. Oh, that looks. The rules look cool. Mmm, scented. No, it's not. Idiot. No, it's. <laughs> <laughs> yes. no, no, no. Oh, I got you, son. Uh, <laughs> it does look nice. Well, I don't have friends here. <laughs> All right. Buried his face. In no, he was like, <laughs> All right. Uh, this is little cards, larger cards, coffee beans. Jason. No box. That's kind of weird. No, the boxes. Nah, I bet you that was. A you think it's was thematic? You think it's yeah. uh? Yeah. It's All probably right. thematic, and I like coffee. <laughs> a oh game yeah. About coffee so in comments, point out. Yes, the reason you're hearing the sound a little off is because we are bouncing it off this table. Sorry. Don't do that. Indonesia's right. official souvenir. Jason, coffee. what is this? Um, let me see. I I gotta see it. You're um, looking at it. It says oh. Butel Schneider. So was that it's the one seals you were excited it's about? A game That's why you were like, yeah, I about this. It was at yeah. a booth oh, okay. and hall. It's a game called Butel Schneider. It was a booth and hall two. You had me pick it up. They gave us a bag with it with the English rules, which is somewhere. Good. Our English Sold rules. Soldier card to. Fantastic. We will find the bag in the English world at some point. All right, I'm going to take is it off. this bag? That is the bag. Whoa, that is and one And there's the rules. So look at that awesome bag, bag that came with it. I don't it. care about the game. Can I have that bag? Show, 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 pull the bag it's out. It's a classic right? trick-taking game. Classic <laughs> trick-taking game. Buto Schneider. Ah. It's a trick-taking game, Z. Here, it's for I you. I want to make a glove around. from this bag. Like Up a Michael out. Jackson do, glove. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Oh, I mean, I have to make do, it up. What is I, happening? Do, do, he's, he's, what do, song are you doing? Do, do, oh, I got do, it now. That's my do, question. The melodic ability has exited the room. Z Garcia's not my lover. Okay, okay, okay. That's, That's good. true. <laughs> but also, Stop. He's got super <laughs> awkward. <laughs> you can't right. sing that song. Right. Super awkward. Moving to the next game. Yes, please. Next I no game. longer want this bag. <laughs> well, put everything you know, in it. Buddy. <laughs> All right, unmask. Uh, I don't remember Which this. Which side are you? It looks like a social <laughs> deduction. Are yeah. we just throwing stuff randomly? Well, we don't have a pile the on the side of the room. Tell us Could we like, make it look a little nice at least? There's no other pile Why? on the side of the room. <laughs> Why would we do such a thing? <laughs> I'm, <laughs> I'm sorry. What do you think? What do you think? <laughs> this box isn't like, even close. I'm not to feeling this one, fellas. I don't know. You're the only one talking about the game. so just... Unmask? Well, I'm trying to I do like keep, the penguin that's hiding going. in there. No. We're talking about Jason's uh, awkward comments <laughs> of moving there, along. There's a penguin. An engaging detective-themed card game for your family and friends. Follow the story of Eric the Awful, no, the Phantom, and obtaining the crown of hope hiding in plain sight, which among you is the real Phantom. It's time to unmask! Right. Except it's a penguin. It's not a. No, it's a phantom. No, so it's a penguin. Here's Fashion. I'm actually interested in this one. It's a two player, five minute dexterity game. Oh, oh yes. Oh, this is no. all you, man. It is. Not. Me. Although that box isn't selling the game at all. I'll what do you mean? There's a hand clearly <clears throat> flicking something. The front of the box. It looks good. The back looks cool. It's a nice size, I'll tell you, for a dexterity <laughs> game. Man. Well, that's yes. true, but there's, I, there's probably two pieces in there. That's true also, yeah. But rules, I'm hoping, as, as well. This one looks interesting. Uh, five colors. How do you pronounce the uh, the name of the company there? Gallery Ouchie? <laughs> is that what it is? I guess. Ochi. Yeah, Ochi. Or Ochi, yeah. Ochi sounds like, Ouchie is kind of like what? Do you have an ouchie? Ouchie. <laughs> Can you kiss it? No. <laughs> I do like the simplicity of this. Five colors and the cards are in five different colors. It's Wow, oh. Jason. This is some I'm fantastic sure. commentary <laughs> 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 out of here. Uh, we'll see, I guess. I don't know. I, this These things can be either a really fun little filler surprise or, or not very good. Okay. How do you say the name of this? A Quest. No. Four Quest. It's A Four Quest. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> I'm not kidding. I was looking on the back and it said A4 Quest. It's like, it's just A. 
Oh, I see the four. So there's an A and a four, and then quest, and uh, why would you do such a thing? That's more clever, but like no one's going to see that. Especially when it doesn't also say it. Well, everyone's going to see it now that we showed them. This can be the logo, and then you say A4 Quest. Also, that's an awful title. A4 Quest. Maybe it's like Battleship. Is it A4 Apple? Hang on. It's an adventure game for one or two players. I mean... This is an A4. Sounds like a paper size. You take the role of a restless hero that goes on a quest where he will face countless monsters by going through following locations. All of that to gain fame and treasures. And paper. Or at least kill some time in this godforsaken and boring town. Is that what it says? <laughs> yes. You <laughs> were making that up. <laughs> you have to try to complete specific tasks while making sure you stay alive. From, like, is keeping Is there no boredom? description about why it's called A4 Quest? Remember, every hero it. needs to eat properly, so hunt for food that's necessary. Whenever you rest, thanks to that, you will get your action dice back. Finally, make good use of your abilities. I mean, what kind of hero would you be if you would forget to take advantage of your unique skills? Yep, that's correct. A dead one. <laughs> Why didn't they call it A2 Quest when there's only two players? Well, that's, that's true. Okay, they could have called it A1 Quest Steak Sauce. <laughs> 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 All right, there's four All heroes. Right, man, whatever. There's four heroes in the box. Oh, there you go. Ah, who knows? Five to fifteen minutes. Wow, it's from Board and Dice, though. They do yeah, good stuff. They do. Who knows? I, I have not heard of this. Well, we spent a lot of time talking about it. Yeah, there you go. More time than the game takes to play. Trick and trouble. Fanked Doc crazy. Oh, that's in. That looks cool. That does look nice. I it's like that It's a cooperative trick-taking game. Ooh. Ah, it's awesome. And it's with the, from Frosted Games. They're the guys who do those minis. I mean, those... Uh, yeah, the, co- the calendars. calendars. Yeah. Calendar. I love this cover, though. I have to say, I really like that look. That's a great look. Is that trick-taking game for three players? Uh, for three. It's for three spiele. Yes. Well, thanks, Dad. Speaking, I, speaking of, yeah, of Frosted... three players. It looks like it's exactly for three players. That's it. I'm okay huh. with that. That is cool. That's neat. This looks really good. This looks really good. I'm excited for that. Speaking of Hi. Frosted, since we're looking at their stuff in their calendar, we did open the 25th one. With, yeah, yeah, Jason. With that. I already said that. Oh, oh, you did. Okay. This is a. All right, let's okay, go. so this is that uh, Luxor. Got it. Next. Uh, that is. Uh, oh, jeez. Netrunner. Android Netrunner. Is it? Yeah, I guess so. Agricola. Agricola. Cov- I don't know. It shows ships? Are those ships? Oh, is this is uh, Rajas of the Ganges. Oh, yeah, this yes. is Rajas of the Ganges. My brain is too tired to think uh, of this. Crossbows and catapults. Is that Heroes of Land, Air, and Sea? No. That one also possibly. No, that's not what it is, Sam. What oh, is that it? looks like uh, Zombicide. Oh, that's the tribute It's the only uh, game I know no, that no, has no. one. This is uh, Zombicide Green Horde. Uh, Green Horde. Horde. Shut up. <laughs> uh, uh, I don't know. It's too tricky because you're not seeing anything but a few pieces. You be quiet. This that one is I know. Quacks or quack or quack. This one I know. The quacks. These are good pictures, by the way. Yeah. They are. That is uh, Everdell. That is that's Detective. Detective. Oh my goodness, that's a good picture. Yes, we don't I like showing the dead meeple there and in the middle. These are from Imperial Settlers. But that's fantastic. That's, you know, a very creative That's image a lot there. of people staring at one dead body there. Yeah, and no one's I come know. along to help. <clears throat> that's um, that game where you shake the stuff around in the box and try to get the different things in the spots from Blue Orange Games. Uh, I don't know that one. That's a cute picture, though. Oh, wow. Sam, that's awesome. That's that that's Catan, Starfarer. Wait, why did they take a picture of this? Is this Starfair's back or something? or They just thought it was cool. That's a great picture. That's an yeah, awesome picture. Um, metal coins. Is that a dragon? I see lots of metal. I have no idea what that one is, but those metal. Oh, the one with the canoe. Someone said was Wendaki. Well, we'll find out I in a second. I one, see a yeah. cheat sheet here. Oh, oh, that was Gloomhaven. Which was Gloomhaven? Oh, okay. It's one of the. I guess that's a big boss that you. Come fight on, eventually. man. That's supposed to be you. That's how you and Gloomhaven comes up. You, you annihilate. Gloomhaven's not as number one anymore after this. Gloomhaven? Clearly. Wait, where was the Gonshine Clever? They said that's in here. I didn't see that. Well, one. we haven't gotten there yet. Gonshine Clever? No, we, we just we did. did. 
Oh, hello. It's only There's a half there a calendar. There it is, on Clever. I know, man, but like the rest of the We're missing a, a page. We're missing oh, a you page. didn't go all the way, did you? Yeah, we did. Oh, that's the back. We're missing a yeah, page. Yeah, this is only half the... They give you first half of the year free. you got to buy the rest <laughs> of the calendar. <laughs> Microtransaction calendar? That'd be awesome. <laughs> they sell you this week. That's all cool. All right, that was fun. The only thing I don't like about that calendar is it's useless as a calendar. It really is. Those the ones with that long thing at the, the bottom. bottom is pointless. But it's pretty. <laughs> it's a cool looking, yeah, it's a bunch of posters basically. Ooh, what's in the bag? Shaky Manor is the name what's of the What's in other. the bag? Farmer Olaf. <laughs> That's a great name. It's a farm trade negotiate, a portable family card game. I remember picking this, this up. This is really cute. Well, that's good. We met them at the pre sh the pre party, whatever they call, it, where the designer shows Where's stuff, this? and Tom said, "Pick that one up." Yeah, this looks cute. I don't know what kind of game it's gonna be, but I like the look of it, and this is really small. All right, Kaiza or Kiza. This is a card game for two to five, where you win cards by bidding. As opposed to others, but the the cards look kind of cool. That, that that's not a bad logo. This was in the French company's booth. They gave us a whole bunch of cool games, which all have kind of thematic feels to them. How well, does this have a thematic feel? Well, this must be the one he's talking about then. Altitude. Get out of here, Kiza. Now this one. This is a new company, by the way. I like the back of this box better, but I don't like the look of the logo. The front isn't isn't really doing anything for me. Mm. Yeah. Ooh. Good. The bag looks neat. That could be good. I, I like this idea of making a sort of a pyramid ship with cards and the artwork seems to line that up. Mm -hmm. Could be good. <coughs> Excited for that one. What else you got? So once the last page of the calendar was the picture, it just has the other pictures on top of it. Ah. Oh. Wow. Oh. I want Bring it back. Bring it back. Oh, really? We need the calendar back. We need the calendar okay, back. Okay, man. Come on, okay. man. You must be... Daddy, I, I feel disappointed if that's the case. It is hidden there, but, <laughs> but that's terrible. It was right in front of our eyes. That's the whole terrible. Time. That's the point. Are you not, what? Look how much better it looks in that corner. That's, that's very. Terrible. That's very Ganjan Clever. Not only that, it's also like. Uh, that's one way to do it. I don't want a picture of Ganjan Clever on my wall anyway. It just Why? dice. No. Here's a promo pack from Marco board. Polo. Yay! Marco that, Polo. That was Get for it. you because you love the game. All right, this guy sat me down. Every time I walked by his booth, he was trying to show me that these pieces, it's some game where you, I, I don't know. It just, there's- It looks like an abstract. It was Are like- these foam? I thought they were wooden, There was like not. 10 different levels of this game. Oh, this looks wooden. I'm, I feel deceived. I thought it was wood too. Oh, look at how gorgeous that image looks. Stained wood pieces. And then these, Still look good, but they're white, but they're actually paper on foam. Well, no, I think it had something to do... I thought maybe there was, like, some way to interact it with an iPad or a board or something. But you had to buy, like, a whole pile of these to get the full game. There was, like, multiple levels. Huh. All you right. I to drop this by because I definitely did not... I feel like we already right. have this one. Because I feel uh, like we talked about this <laughs> just yesterday. Yeah, and we then so. And we all said, pass it to Jason. Here, so, just pass it to speaking me. speaking of Iberian Rails... Do you rails, like the other rail games? Um, so, the reality is, the rail games in this category, like Steel Driver, Chicago Express, are not my favorite rail games, because I find that the stock market's a little too flimsy. And this is another one. This one actually adds a cool mechanic where the people... Um, Apparently, the powers, are, are traveling in loops. You, you have superpowers in this one where everyone They're leaving the picks track. power. Superpowers? Is that why the train's flying? Okay. You, you draft powers in it. It's... It's is it too light? That, that sounds the better, but is it it's the same the, thing? It's the same thing, but it's the best of the series. Like, if you hated Continental Divide like I did yes, or other did. games, yes. this is the best of it because you have powers and you actually get to do something more interesting than just the same old, same old. Mm -hmm. But if you don't like that kind of game, you won't like That's interesting, more. man. You don't like Chicago Express, then? No, I don't like any of that series. Wow. And, and this one, one, I agree with him. I don't like it either. This one, these powers right here, you can see the three powers. How can you not like Chicago You draft them each turn, so you're Wabash. drafting new powers is the only cool thing about this one. That sounds better, though. Here's the rules of that last game, that Aromat game. It's a quick start guy. Look at that. Oh, all boy. right. Gnomeland. This is from Strato Libre, who is all over the place with their games, so it could be great, could be not. I don't uh, like that theme. <sighs> Why so, gnomes are cool? What's your, I don't. don't like, are you a gnomist? I don't, don't like. Don't so, I don't like fantasy. Things. You know, I, this is like. Like I'm more excited by that gear stuff than I am by uh, like the gnomes and all that. This is all you guys. Good news. This 
was on my uh, <laughs> first box. First, first box, box is, is down. Done. <laughs> of 18 uh, boxes, we've just gone through one. I still feel like I picked up more than 18 boxes worth. It, this feels like we didn't get How? it all. That was a. That's more games than most people get in a year. Not oh, me. As everyone knows, Way I now more. get 7.30 a year. Yeah, not me. Two, two per day. <laughs> <laughs> we took that poll on the cruise. You're insane. All right, what else we got? Let's see it. All right. Electioneer. Electioneer. Is this the election cool. time in Hong oh, Kong? Yeah, oh, this actually does look that good. That looks really cool. You like this? This election look? Teams rock. I don't like that style of game. How in the world can you say this looks good? It looks looks. Sam's got colors and lines, man. Oh Come on, what you colors hate? and lines brings me in. It uh, does. actually squares, right? Is that what it does it for you, grids? <sighs> yeah. Yeah, baby. Anyway, electioneer looks like a um, hard pass from Sam and myself. You fellas enjoy. We will. All right, here's I, Fog I of War. It will actually. Fog, Fog of War. Fog of War. <laughs> Fog of Love. That's a well, sequel. It hasn't come out. <laughs> Fog of Love, but it's called It Will Never Last. That's one of the expansions, yes. Relationships are hard. This expansion is harder. Great. Wow. All right. We have, yeah. Uh, there's three of these, actually, so if they're not all together, we'll oh, see Oh, yeah, here they are. The Trouble with In-Laws. That doesn't, I don't even understand how that's possible. Mm-hmm. What else? <laughs> Paranormal Express. Like Normal. Romance. 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 What is wrong with your <laughs> reading ability? <laughs> I can't Fog, get the words out of my mouth. War, Paranormal Express. <laughs> Trade actually, That actually sounds a lot that of sounds fun. Sounds good. That sounds pretty good. <clears throat> this met, turns the game a little bit legacy, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, I haven't messed with these, but uh, yep. That's I good. do know for a fact that the expansion content in here. Is like that much, unfortunately. Box is largely empty. All right, this game is called Car Clash. Car Clash. Car Clash sounds cool. Defeat your opponents on a trail like of pitfalls. It looks like it's Halloween another Mario thing. It's game. amazing. This is the same French company that just started legally out. distinct. <laughs> <laughs> it's uh, me, Car Clash. <laughs> Oh, wow. Uh, maybe. Maybe. Hey, this is from the same company, these I games. Yes. They had a whole bunch of new games. Is that from that one that with those small minutes, white boxes we saw yes. earlier? Yes, it's a whole French company that put them out. Okay. They shared in the French pavilion with Blue Cocker and the other Last boots. I like this. This is I like these size boxes though. These remind me of those old. Remember those uh, the games, those card games that Odin came out? Mm -hmm. They were the long ones. Mm -hmm. But that doesn't show a picture of the game. But this one's Metro, and I like this one. It's like vertical. It should have chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> I want to, interesting. I want to see what's in these. These yeah, look yeah, interesting. Yeah, yeah. It's, look, I'm assuming it's a card game. It looks neat. No, we got to save it for our boring unboxings. Oh, that's true. Cheers. Yeah, these look all right. Which we will be doing forever. <laughs> all right. Yes. This vertical looks cool. Hey, it's a book. Kings of War Vanguard. Ooh, that's a Sammy thing. This is a rule book, Z. Uh, then that's definitely... <laughs> ah! Wait. I surely uh, didn't get this. Who, who, did you pick this up, Sam? Because I didn't I pick this so. one up. I don't think so. I didn't get it. Rule book? It's romantic. They uh, might have dropped it off at the booth. It's their, it's their, um, it's it's their uh, miniatures game. Yeah, one of them. Kings of War. Yeah. Here, yeah. Sam, I'm gonna put that somebody else so got it. Sam never played it. Somebody else got it. You don't tell on them, Jason. You know why? Because we send you to Ratland. <laughs> It's the perfect board game to play. You have a clan of rats. There's like shields in this. This one actually. This looks good. Jason would love it. Has little cheese pieces. I'm all in this. Like thing. actual cheese. Eighty that does color look cheese good. pieces. Eleven white, four black, forty-four yellow, eleven orange, four purple, and six blue. You have to cut them. Don't eat the purple cheese. I think it's a no, bad blue idea. Blue cheese is not technically blue, but at least you get away okay, with that. Okay, there hasn't been many games. Where that rats. looks interesting. That looks good. That does look good. Conquest of the Sewers. Oh. Oh, it's from someone named Garcia. Look at that. Oh, never mind then. Get it out. Eduardo Garcia. We can do it! <laughs> Turn it over so you can see. Yeah, what does the back look like? Oh. That looks all right. That looks pretty cool. That could be good. That could be good. Here you go. Rattling what else we got? Yummy Monsters! 
This is a monstrous food tossing. It looks like you're tossing food into a tray uh, in the middle. It's the, it's the Decilis games from Greece. They don't normally yes. make just kids games, but I guess they're... No, they're, but their games are almost always very light. Very light, light family. Yeah. That's, or, a, that's yeah. a cute cover. That's this a cute a, cover. Like this a Toys R Us, I'd buy it. If this was a Toys R Us, well, no one would buy it. Because there is no, no Toys No, they're coming Ross. back. Someone bought them. Toys R Us got bought out by somebody. I thought they were gone. Gone. They went out of business. All the oh, stores closed. I know. Someone's bringing them back. I thought. Oh, That's really? That guy didn't want to grow up. I knew it, man. <laughs> That's a good joke. That was not bad. That is a good joke. What was it? He said that's because the guy those, didn't want to grow up. All that practicing in front of a mirror is doing something right. No, that's right. a good joke. That's, okay. <laughs> Maybe you shouldn't sleep. <laughs> all right, Sam. I'm not even touching this one because it's. Here's Negan. Oh, I hate that guy so much. Yeah. He's the worst. Isn't he the good guy in the series, though? <laughs> if he's a good guy, then I need to watch this show. If he's a good guy, I hate to see who the villain is. The zombies. Honestly. No, I picked the zombies over him. Actually, are the zombies good now? I haven't seen it in a while. I think the zombies are just scenery now, aren't they? Yeah. No, apparently they are becoming more sentient. Homie, spoilers. I'm just saying. You can see that in the trailers of their show. I haven't seen it since 1988. <laughs> Orbit Battle. I gotta be honest, guys. This cover is not doing anything for what me. What do you mean, man? Is Look, it's got aliens, better? but they have flags. Flags. It's flags. The <laughs> Why do they have flags? <laughs> On your spaceship. <laughs> <laughs> uh, huh. Wow. Is this a dexterity game or just Oof. an abstract? Oof. I don't know. I kind of like the look of the board. Ugh. I kind of really? like the look of that board, yeah. It but looks the game, way who knows? If it's an abstract movement game, oh, it looks like a strategal type board. Sure. It might be good. Well, yes, all these games might be good. No, no, some games might not be good, okay? <laughs> some of those games are probably. This game's not from good. Robin Red Games. It's called Africa Park. Showing. Some bunch of white people. white people on it. That seems well, like animals. A bunch of animals. This could is the be, same French could company. Could be South Africa Park. It's Le Jujula. Those are the same huge French critters. Companies. Quick pause. We hit sixty thousand. Woo! Woo -hoo. All right. It's Ten thousand per box. Woo -hoo. Uh, there's not a whole board on here, but it looks pretty cute. Oh, this. This, this is a kid's explained. game, though. That's the thing I can't tell. And that, look at the cover. That's got to be a kid's it, game. It is. Yeah, he maybe. explained it to me that you bounce around and you have to get different animals oh, in yeah, different yeah, locations yeah. Four in the park. This is for four and up. All right. Okay. Okay. And apparently it's solitaire. You can give your four-year-old this on their own and be like, you can go entertain <laughs> So I am not buying a TV. <laughs> Sam, this one's for Sam, y'all. Hmm? Back Ninja Squad. Ninja Squad. Ninja Squad from Backspindle Games. You're cool. a Backspindle fan, right? Yeah, I am. So I'm I feel like this game already exists, or does it not? Did it just come out? Uh, well, it exists. I know, but I feel like I've seen this before. Maybe I'm just Maybe thinking of other Ninja games from Crypt Maybe. Cryptozoic. There's been a lot of games Ninja All Stars. Kind of no, Ninja All Stars was from Cryptozoic. This but that has the same looking font, I think. Yeah, it, it does. does. I think ninjas only have one font that they use. <laughs> wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's on their letterhead, right? When cool. they send out letters. Like there. Spindle. All, right. All right. Put that one in your pile, home. I got it in my pile. If you've been are wondering we drafting why, you yes. a story? If you're Here wondering we why we haven't shown these games oh. off at all, because they just showed up. And yes. Finally. Oh. This is so, so excited. These are, these are amazing looking games. Roxley is awesome when it they comes to production. They are killing it with production. You saw their that dice. Um, the dice battle game, the one with the where I pulled out the trays and showed them all. I don't remember that. The one that's like strike. No. Dice battle. What no. else is there? The dice battle. Stop it. I don't know. <laughs> no, no, I don't think a tennis so. match. I know it's good stuff. Yeah. Anyway, I don't dice think so. Dice throne. Oh, dice throne. I didn't know, but I oh, think I saw it at PAX last year. Oh, the production is yeah. unbelievable. That's a, that's a, is, that heavy, a, man. is that a what you call it? Yeah, a game. Yeah. Dice. Shut up. Dice Throne, like... Look, you're reflecting on that dice. one. No, no, no. Dice Throne is... The best way to describe it would be... I'm your head. Hold on. <laughs> That's just weird. The best way to describe it would be like a two... Like a two... Player versus player King of Tokyo, almost. 
You yeah, roll right. dice, you get combos, and the combos will activate different special but isn't that anyone, right. anyone tuning in right now, by the way, we are not talking about this. If you're tuning in going, oh. wait, there's dice battles in Brass? I thought it was a Euro game. Anybody watching this knows Brass, but this is why they haven't been reviewed, but they're here now, so yeah. Oh, well, these the, are very Brass gorgeous Brass Lancashire products. is the original. But so you know what? All I one. hear people talk about is the new one. That's because everyone's played this one for years. So hold on, so... Brass has been around, I remember the original cover, so it got reprinted. Yes. And they put out a sequel at the same time. Correct. The people in our game group say this one's better. This is the new one. Yes. Yeah. Well, I would have to, I mean, they're both, I assume, uh, from um, Martin Wallace. I would imagine we have to play Martin Lincoln Wallace Shire is. First, though. Yeah, but this one has all more names on it. See? Oh, okay. Yeah, this and is if Martin there's Wallace. one thing I know about Martin Wallace is that when he has developers on his games, they get better, for but sure. But he's been getting better anyway, I would say. So, so he's been making lighter games, is what you mean. Uh, it's just better games, Boy, I is, mean. No, he's been making a lot of lighter games. Oh, Wildlands. You know, lot, uh, Wildlands, that is super light. Did you uh, like it? Yeah, I did. All right, here you go. These ones are amazing. What else we got? Rise of the Necromancer. Now we're talking. Although, uh, bring this on guy, the evil. That guy just looks like the Necromancer rised him. Rise, rise, rise I got him. it. Rose him. Rose, Rose whatever. Him. Rise of those necromancers. That box was much faster. This looks That's because it had bigger games. This looks big really games. good. Look at all that darkness on the cover, man. Look at that. E e oh my goodness, you almost crushed my hand there. <laughs> what happened? This, oh, this doesn't goes. seem like my style. Ah, uh, this looks cool. Yeah, yeah. It's a little long, maybe. What is it? Thirty-five minutes. <laughs> Another one! That deserves Amazon. That deserves. Jason's on fire. He's on fire, man. Ooh, snacks! I'm drafting this. <laughs> Those snacks! Are, Tim Finn! Those are soybean chips. They're right. what? Delicious. Soybean chips. Well, yeah, what is the expiration date on this? Is it going to be good anymore? Wait, we're not done yet. Wait, oh. it's just all food. Oh, bag I know these are good. Return? These are. Don't open that, man. Why not? We got more coming. Why not? Oh, those are those biscuits. You don't want that to try those really no soybean good. chips? That's going to be crispy on the microphone. It's going to be yeah, awful. Yeah, there's like. No, no. Like, uh, yeah, pretzels. Theater here, in the round. Here we go. This is our first unboxing of the day. <laughs> soybean chips. You can hear it. Let me show you what's inside. I didn't know what in the round oh, is. Oh, Zura. I thought this, this said. This is going to be like, I bet someone out there is just like yeah, taking off their going, headphones. Ah. Like, okay. Let me wait till they dunk I thought this said Zerd. Can we, do a, can we do an unboxing for a second and unbox something? No. 99 oh, cards are in this box. 99 cards in the zero box. 99 cards in the zero. Yeah, that's, that's good. 98 cards in the... Meanwhile, Picnic. Meanwhile, back on planet Earth. It's a 10. Oh, Devere. Oh, that's cool. Yeah? I like Devere yeah, stuff. Went right by. Went right it? by. Hey, boo -boo. This Here, you can cool. add this I one. You need a picnic basket? Uh, Have you already played it? The this expansion? is just a reprint of the expansion. Mr. Jack extension? No, I think I got rid one. of this one. Suppose and kept just New one. York. What does it add? More people? Yeah. This ah. is old. This is just reprinted. I never played the expansion because I hated the base game more so people, much. More people, yeah. More people. Oh, okay. The problem is I don't, I don't even have the original anymore. It has Wolverine in it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> You gotta show that, come on. It has Wolverine in it. <laughs> Absolutely. It does have Wolverine, Wolverine in it. Wolverine is right there. You gotta you gotta scoot in on that. that is Wolverine. No! Oh, the other <laughs> way, the other way. Stop <laughs> moving. Scoot in, not up. Wolverine, Wolverine <laughs> right there. Dead center. Hugh Jackman makes Did it Did you kill those people, bub? <laughs> Definitely. Definitely. All right. Definitely. This game is Sonar Family. And Sonar I is just a reprint of... Sonar Family is a reprint of Sonar. Are you sure? Yes. There's no other differences? I heard it's Don't slightly different. Something. Is that at least what I was told I think he I just made that up. up, but... No, when I picked it up, I was told it's slightly different. As in it's a different box. Yeah, as in it has a different box, a different <laughs> artwork. Yes. It is, it is sonar. If you look at the side, it's sonar. Look, Z, model with three. <laughs> All right. No! We haven't seen that yet. We got one of these at Essen, didn't we? I know. Yeah, no, we got before right. Essen. Yeah. Oh, this is for Dice Tower Library. That's, That's for Dice Tower Library, but it is I've a I've already really reviewed game. it, so if, go check that out if you're curious. If you like Nourishima Hacks, this is your game. Yeah, sure. Can, can we, like, move the <laughs> way? Because I'm, like, at full arm's length here. Yeah, you can bring it up a little bit if you want to. Here, keep bringing it. Bring, bring it. it up. Bring it up. 
Bring, bring it, it up. No, that's too far. Stop. Bring it, bring it down. Space bring it freaks. down. Stop your weirdness. Hello. Here's the expansion for Space Freaks. All right, get this out of here. The Violet Morass. Violet Morris. <laughs> Violet Morass. <clears throat> you guys are... You need to... No, that's him. What's next? <laughs> the Last books. Heroes. More books. That's not even worth keeping. Kenny, just get rid of that this piece of garbage. <laughs> well, what is it? it? It's a comic book. Last Heroes. <laughs> that game is really, <laughs> really bad. Did in you my play it? Yes, I really dislike it. Well, maybe I'll like it. I, maybe you will. That was it's good. That was not. understanding and fair. I don't want to play it. Yeah, more that's right. wrong. I trust him. Look at that thing. That thing looks bad. It looks you like it'll hurt people. Bad. It'll hurt people. So here's more stuff for the networks. But this is a promo. More executives. So promo. Looks like a promo pack. Yeah. Promo pack. More stuff for the networks. Here's rules for the solo mode of Dragon Castle. Cool. Here's some. This is like rules a cartoon. <laughs> is, that, is that rules or just a comic? That looks like a color. It looks book. good. I mean, that's nice artwork. This game is called Grand Dog Park from <laughs> Flora and Nora. Okay, I don't really know anything about this one. BGG does. Why does that have a BGG? Oh! No, this is the game. Games. This is the game where I love the cover of this game. So. Oh, yeah. The problem is, you and I like the same oh, yeah. stuff. Silk. Well, I might not like the game, I just think the cover's great. The cover does look like big silk. Oh, the game looks good. Who's the designer? Devor. That is not the design. It's There's a the company here, by the way. Luis, Luis, Luis Ranedo. 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 Stop it. It is a cute cover. I like that cover a lot. Also, these Luis creatures Ranedo. are terrifying. Sam, I think you'll like this one. Oh, my goodness. Geometry Strategy. That's Sounds a, amazing. This has got to be top ten titles at SMS Now, listen. Best year. You may not believe this, but I actually asked Jason to go out of his way to get this one. He did. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. He did. No, I did. He because did. look at the pieces in it. It's gorgeous. This one is open. I know it is. It's it's a dexter. It's because they gave us the only copy they had left, which was the show off copy. They had like weird pieces. They're like right. and they all move right. differently. Like chess. Shut up. It looked good. Hey, look, get them out. Get them out. It is cool. It's an impromptu unboxing, apparently. Okay, so I'll tell you how they move. Look, this <laughs> one goes around in a circle and it moves. Look. Yep. It That's an on, abstract it can go thinking. These four squares right there. Uh, this, this one, one, this one goes boing, boing, <laughs> boing, boing. Move this one cuber. rolls in a straight line. See? This one rolls also in a straight line, but the ride is bumpy. I'm glad you're here, uh. Jason. <laughs> <laughs> I think this one looks cool. I like it. These I pieces thought are, so, too. These pieces are neat. The spring is super weird. All right. But then there so are did these. It, did you actually... Hear about how the game works? Oh, there's like no. Yeah, no. Uh, yes, I did. I didn't. I just no. picked it up. It's each one has a specific way, and if they're upside down, they rank slightly differently too. You can also oh. get into the red zone and score a touchdown. <laughs> you guys are the worst. Uh, no, sir. I have a feeling me and Tom are going to be playing this one without you two. What if no one called pass interference? All right, so. Oh, Go. too soon. My I don't man. even care about football. I don't know. This game got wrecked. Yeah, too soon. <laughs> what happened to this game? This Wait a full, second. Wait, it's full of chocolate, but it says the word vessel on it. Oh, dang it. Wait a second. Did this chocolate melt in the in the transfer or is it hope. so good? Do they cool those ships? I'll let you I can't I can't do it. I can't. I said if the Kickstarter funded, I would let myself eat some dessert. Well, let's see how far we are. <laughs> what is it? Oh, it smells funky, actually, because yeah. of the cardboard. 62. I guess I'm not eating dessert tonight. 63. 63. 5. Like the cardboard. Cardboard chocolate. Yeah. Oh! These okay. are out already. You guys are all lame. I just I'm announced these. One. If I die on camera right now, it's because this chocolate yeah, is like three months if old. If you die on camera, that's a really bad chocolate. That's like the worst be, chocolate ever. Yeah. That'll be, that'll be a lot but, of views. But though. I feel like I need to <laughs> That's good. One. Yeah, yeah. We'll put a little song in If he dies, we will help him as much as we can. You but you keep that camera running. <laughs> will you back okay. this game, please? All right. Four month old chocolate. Let's see. Okay, so I heard about these. This is a new, this is a new series of games. Here's the other two. They're called Sherlock. I saw these. Uh, I guess you, yeah, like you said, they. Enigma I, I Studios. Did not realize they were out. But yeah. they're working with another company, um, uh, Abacuspiel. 
Okay. And they're like they're they're in a similar vein. They said to the Three Secrets games, but you're yeah, working they're... together. I don't know. They, I'm hoping they're good. Neat. This is a tiny little box. I didn't realize they were in our. He did, man. Hold on a sec. I rate this chocolate a nine. It is really good. It's an awesomeness rating of nine. Awesomeness rating of nine. Hook a brother up, man. You guys really it's should. It's already gone. No, it ain't no, no, all It went it. into Come the vessel house. Here Wait, hook a brother up. Let, let, let the, me get the, the video. The, the video editor stole our candy. True. Truth. What else we got? I had the mint one, which was really good. Oh, mint does not travel mint. well over the ocean. Uh, everyone. No, 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 no. I'm not eating any dessert till after the Kickstarter. Okay. Funds. When it funds, then I'm going to light it up. Everyone. Actually, I'm buying a cake. <laughs> oh, that was close. Just for myself. And I'm going to eat it on the ride home. <laughs> what? <Well, I'm> traffic. <laughs> <laughs> oh, these right. look cool. This is called Grimwood, oh. a chaotic card game. Are these Ooh, escape rooms? This? I don't know, Jason. They're a little, they're a little vague on exactly what we've they're like. We've seen this, right, Tom? Wasn't there one of these for a while? I don't remember. Here? I remember there was someone. Ooh. Yeah. Okay. I don't know anything about it. This is Magic Maze Hidden awesome. Rolls. This, this is the. Nine. Oh, I just talked about this. Premature. You didn't like it? Not that great. So like a 5.5, would you give that, it a seal of approval? It's got that gooey stuff. Do you need the hammer? It. It, had better gooey mint. it had gooey mint. It was like really good dark chocolate with mint cream in the middle. Creme. Uh, you've had better, <laughs> I, I promise. I've had better. <laughs> That's why I gave right. it a 9 no, instead I mean, of a saying, 10. From the different places that we've been, you've had better chocolate. I'm actually interested in this magic it's, maze, but the problem is magic maze is already stressful enough. Do you need hidden rolls in it? Yeah. Yes. This is our upcoming cute. expansion. Oh, oh, this is a, a preview this of is that. A preview. Got this is the this is like the That's only copy in the US. Huh. Is this an older game? No, Bali That's I an reviewed, expansion. I want to say well earlier this year it must have been. This game you reviewed? That's an expansion. The original. This is an expansion. That's an expansion for Claus oh, Jürgen Raid is the uh, designer of Carcassonne. Indeed he is. I didn't know he was still designing actually. The game is not brand new. You are right about that. That's what I was asking. I thought I heard of him designing that ages ago. This is, was originally called Rapa Nui. Yes. This came out a few years ago. Yes. What are you judging games now? No. Uh, I reviewed the I reviewed the base game. What are you doing? Every time you hit it with your finger, I'm gonna hit it with. Oh, I reviewed the uh, base yeah. game, and uh, I did. I did. <laughs> and the expansion just came out. Actually, you know, not not that far apart, which is. Curious, because I wasn't expecting expansion for this. All right, Shikoku. Shikoku. The middle path seeks moderation. No extremes. To be the first or What's the last. Extremes. I'm or reading extremes? it the way it's written. To oh, be okay. the first or the last one okay. is not welcome. <laughs> Every time Tom says a bad word, are you gonna hit the hammer too? So there you go, GDM. GDM. Shikoku. Yeah. No! <laughs> My hammer. I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm having it from now. <laughs> um, GDM does some reference. interesting stuff, but good reference. Well, thank you, thank well you. Uh, their games are not always as finalized as I would like. They have some translation issues sometimes. They're Spanish companies. Like extreme? Oh, they, take, they take it to the extremes. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> <laughs> Here's mosquitoes. It's a card game, but there's no English, so I'm not even sure. Mosquitoes. Mosquitoes. It's a Faduti game. It's a Faduti Manigo game. To tell you, if I, I'm going to give you two guesses as to what kind of game it is mechanically. Auctioning. A chaotic ball bidding. selection game. What is the Faduti basically been making for the Bowl last like, eight years? Citadels. No, I don't know. Bluffing games. Oh, is it? It's another one. Oh, is this very similar to CIA and KGB? Probably. Probably. I don't know. That's not his. Why is though. it called Dragons though? That's such a boring name. Because there's dragons in it. He wrote his thesis on dragons. <laughs> he did. You knew that, right? No, he didn't. He did. He did. See, I can never tell what a big troll that he was. No, no, he did. He's no, he mentioned really did. that on his website do you, do you plenty of times. Testing it. Do you read his website? You don't believe me, homie? Um, Snoops it. <laughs> For duty, <laughs> dragons. <laughs> He did. I, I, I got to see his theme on the dragon. But the scene. problem is, it's just another f bluffing game, I think, you know? <laughs> or another Volkswagen game. I think so, game. anyway. I think so. If I'm wrong, I apologize to everyone involved. <laughs> That's just mostly me. You don't want a central thing to eat. He's been making a lot of bluffing games. The simpler, the better lately. Let me see dragons. <clears throat> see dragons. All right. Anywho. It's, so, it's, it's Matigo, so I'm 
Yeah. Definitely yeah. going to try yeah, yeah, yeah. it. Yeah, yeah, Absolutely. Monster Band. It was a band. Of monsters. Okay, I'm, I'm A monster gonna... band. Come on, man. Oh, man. Come on. All right, you're fine. Oh, this is brunch, man, not band. This is just matching, but they all have like similar characteristics. You gotta find ones that are exactly the same. Kids game. Monster. Monster oh, brunch. Oh, it's just monster band on the monster hood, but it's monster bunch. brunch in English. No, it was a bunch. bunch. It was a monster bunch. It was a bunch. Okay, this looks a interesting. Decline hex. <laughs> in this game, you have a witch hanging from a stick. Decline hex. This is how you do it. No, she's flying around on a broomstick. Okay. I don't know anything else. That's cute it's, enough. That's it's, enough, all right? You'll hoop. take it and you'll like it. Is this a reprint of that old game where hoop. you flew around with the broomsticks? Remember that one? No. There was an old game where you flew around with broomsticks. It maybe came out about eight, nine years ago. That was just back when they made you sweet. It was called like, Witches You fantasized something. it. Um, I don't know that one. Huh? There you go. Okay, this is a choir from 3M. Jason, do you remember why this is in the box? Someone delivered it for you. I don't know <laughs> No, why. this is like a, a special thing that uh, is for is you. Is it the wooden tiles? Specifically, I think. If it's the wooden tiles. If it's the wooden tiles, the Scrabble tiles, it's good. Otherwise, yeah. If it's the plastic ones, let's just toss it. Let's just toss it. It's the plastic, it's the plastic, plastic. ones. I used to own that version. That's exactly the one I uh I don't know why. I used to have. It was delivered for you. I wasn't there. Was I there when they gave it? it? I don't know. Now, the one I, I had was actually in better quality than this one. I guess they thought you liked a choir? I just know grandma's house. <laughs> yeah. This is what that is the weirdest the part of this unboxing yet, I'll tell you. All right. Well, All right. Do you, do you like a choir, Tom? Well, yeah, I like a choir. Do you like this version of Acquire, the 3M bookshelf version? The original version. Not as much as I like the, the, the really nice Avalon Hill. We don't have that one, do we? The nice Avalon Hill one? No, oh. no. Uh, cool. I guess this will do then. That's pretty good. It's a trip back in time right there. That'll do, Donkey. No, All this right, is new. Crisis at Steamfall. Not Seafall. 1968. Although the back of the box shows us nothing about this, the it's game. It's a piece of paper, or this is the actual back? Yeah, way to touch the microphone. Sorry. All right. I'm being I don't told know to fix my mic. About this. It is now whatsoever. fixed. That box doesn't actually give us any sort of. I like the steampunk thing. That's. I mean, that's all I got going. It's. A, it's 30 minutes per player. There's some plastic bags. It also says it can be played by a single player. Mm -hmm. I can't tell if it's co-op. I can't tell anything. Oh, it says it. A cooperative slash competitive experience. So, okay. sure. That again doesn't tell me anything. This is a bell tower, but I don't this know what this good. game. I don't know what this is for. Looks good. I, I hate like, steampunk like games. games that in looks general. like, I like the, the Heroes of Land, Air, and Sea. I'm not sure. Uh, I don't know what this uh, is. Three boxes done. Card yeah, sleeves. In one hour. In one hour. We got three this, boxes in one hour. Card so sleeves. Six hours. We got this in the. Yeah. Well, again, we're gonna keep going until the Kickstarter funds or we run out of things. Right? What else we got? Let's do it. Doing Some well. of these are smaller. This one's a much smaller thing. All right. Allow Here's the Ancient World Multi-Game System. Hello. <laughs> this is your abstract. I don't I can't like even open it. Multi-Game System. It's tape. You have to take the tape off. Yeah. No, this is cool. Wait, let's look at this. This is actually really cool. And the pieces, wait till you see the pieces in this. That's also the ancient world. There's a whole bunch they gave us what? for this. <laughs> I'm like, let's look at a new game. This it's is, the same one! This is a uh, war engine, it says. Oh, no. What do you think? Wait, you have to see the pieces of this, at least. I feel like I don't have to, but... Yes, because it's to. gorgeous. Why did they tape it, though? We can't move on. Uh, they taped it. We can't... Yeah, they taped it for us. But those pieces are not like blowing my mind. Okay, this Here. is only the cardboard version. I didn't realize that. I'm unimpressed. What were you expecting? Oh no, it's wood. Gold? It's wood. It's wood. Feel it. It's wood. It's oh, they're wood pieces. Stuff. Oh, that's because it's laser like cut that wood. Die. Oh, I love that smell. Oh, Tom see. likes the laser Something cut wood smell. Another. I do. But I do. Supposedly, there's 20 different abstract games in that there. That's disgusting. When, why would you get excited <laughs> about that? No. When was the last time you played one of those multiplayer, multi games in one box thing that was good? I agree. 504, I liked. You didn't love 504. I didn't love it, but I liked it. The only it. good game in there was 137. That's it. I like 269. <laughs> um, Both of you are very wow, bad at jokes. Okay. I am done. Moving it along. Wow. Now that looks demonic. All right, Tag City. As Ooh. in 
You are tagging things like a yeah, tag your Yeah, basically Jet Set, Jet Set Radio, the board game. You don't know what that is? Oh, oh this is um, Jet Set Radio. You run around the video game tagging the city up. Games. Who else did they do? What else did this they do? This looks cute. They another game that Miles Morales tags things. Yeah, I saw that. They did, yes. Um, and it's illegal. I want to say that. So um, Miles Morales is oh, like Spider Man, right? And he's a criminal? He's a criminal? He's a criminal. I don't agree with that. Not, no. It's not my Spider Man. No, no, that's not okay. <laughs> that's not, not my. Hashtag not my Spider Man? I like this. Uh, the look of this game. They did. They did, I do uh, too. Linda's Farn as well, I believe. I really like the look of this game. No, I do too. And I like the theme. It's like a, a different yeah, kind of theme. Yeah, it's different, yeah. And then... <laughs> and then uh, Dictionary. What is this? This looks like a fun abstract. old software. <laughs> Windows 95 software. Axio <laughs> That's what that looks like. It does. Oh, come on, man. Why Challenger would you publish this looking like this these days? Challenger oh, that's better inside. The manual also sides. looks like a Windows 95 software manual. Hang on. Wait. Um, the wait also, there's a CD stop. rum in here. Could I <laughs> wait? CD rum? <laughs> what? Wait. I just need to say All something, right. Tom. This was from the same company who did the geometry game, and you said pick up their other games, too. I, Oops. Why wow. don't you just look at the geometry one? Well, Open we got Axio, too. Foot. Um... Chew on shoelace. The password look, the is on the page same, six, line 15. What? The password. When you put in disk 2, it asks you what the password is. Got it. I used to it hate that. Key. It has a user key, uh, right? All right. Paleolithic. This is from uh, Shepherd Games. I, you've reviewed some of their things in the past, I believe. Shepherd, Shepherd. I don't remember. I, I want to say this looks like a kid's game, but then they're over here in strategy. They give it four stars. This isn't a kid's game? It doesn't. It looks like one that's not it really. It looks like it's just a, cute, but not. It a looks kid's like game. it could be a kid's game. How do you game? spell it? P A Paleolithic. Paleolithic, like the Paleolithic, like age. I don't have that word like memorized on how to spell it. It is phonetic. This uh, Shepherd has also made games. Adventurer's Kit. Oh, that's a bunch of kids' games that are sitting on my shelf at home. Ocean this. Crisis and Numer Numeracy. Yeah, you haven't seen any of stuff, but their other stuff is definitely kid stuff. This is seven and up. It has to be a kid's game. All right, all right. No, yeah, it's that's too bad. A kid's it looks game. good. It's adrenaline. I some good games. We got man. this so that we can play the expansion. Okay. Yes. Oh, oh. What is that? It's a Go box side. of hockey pucks. Can you mag drop? Are these mag drops? mag drop. Bro. I do what I want. Bro, do you even mag drop? No, it's uh, a toss game. It I'm, looks like a beanbag toss I'm game. But with, this. With, no, it's it's like a work, you work out, right? It's a workout equipment is what it is. I don't think so. Aim, throw. How'd you get so buff playing board games? <laughs> playing Dosa. Oh, I see something next. Oh, okay. That's cool. I like this, man. Sam hates this game. Oh, this oh, game looks amazing. Sam hates this game. You, know, you, you will probably like it. The I will. Well. Layers, but the donkey is, uh, game. We, we played so you got to put these in match an exact pattern no. yep. by we manipulating it? it. Yep. That's amazing. No, it's timed as well. It's timed and I'll beat you every time and that's the problem. Oh, it's a game? Yes, it's a race. He just called know. you out, homie. I don't know if you noticed. He said, Seriously. it is timed and I'll beat you every time. Seriously. You think you would? Yes. The, oh. the, yes, Sam. We played. Uh, these let's are get ready to layer. <laughs> these are divisive games. Half the group of people will not be well do good at them, and the other half will do great at them, and they'll always win. Yeah, so because you hang out it, with the cool people who do uh, well, and know, the I ones don't like who uh, don't. I want to have a. I want to have a chance to win a game, uh, and these kind of games, I know I don't have a chance. Ah! Wow. <laughs> That uh -oh. was that was a bad what decision. What are you doing? Why would you try? Did you really think no. you had the, it was the fun. counterweight? I've been working out. I've done my arm for body strength Only. today. You've been to the gym like six times. <laughs> Shut up. So the thing is, it was fun. Why did it get so dark? But it was fun, the but the, the I problem I think you hit the lights when you knocked down the box, probably. That it is a race game. And race hit games, you know you hate playing race games with no, me no, for I that reason. For speed games. Because he's too good. Yes, we know. You really got to stop with the, the, the horn. No, no, I'm just saying. I'm pretty sure I could beat Jason <laughs> in that game. No, you I'm loving me. me. I'm telling now. you, it, it, it's all about how fast your brain can put together all the different layers and what side of the thing. Maybe I could beat him at that. Nope. Again, I guarantee it. You're both suggesting suggestions. Should I be quiet? Yeah, you need to be quiet. <laughs> <laughs> we'll beat you too, Z. I got half mind to open that game up right now. I have a half mind to beat him physically. <laughs> Formosa, Forget the game. Formosa the flowers. Oh, that thing looks pretty. 
That looks really cool. I like huh. games with flowers. You know, I've, I've reviewed a few games. Um, okay. I've That's reviewed, okay. I like games with flowers. I, I like know, the little like flower shop. Thing. Remember that one? Does that this game company, have flowers? I like games with flowers. This company, I've reviewed a few of the games, and they're pretty clever. They, they, do, they do good They better be good, because otherwise they're going to be like, yeah, this game so-so. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's true. <laughs> that's true. It's not a great title for your company called So-So Games. Oh, Doob. these cards look pretty. Yeah, this is but, a trick-taking game. But the game looks... Wait. Dude. Oh, that's by the guys who did Ebbs. That's nah. by the same guys as Ebbs. And Ebbs is a great I'm not, trick-taking I'm not a game. fan of the artwork on the, on the player cards. This is a very, cards. very tiny publisher. I think it's basically one dude. Yes. Uh, How hard do you think that it's to manufacture a box that size? Though? That's got to be a pain. That yeah, looks like annoying, a beer stein. Right? I don't know what it's supposed to be. The texture it's of like a, to be a golf beer. ball. It's a beer. It's one of those beer oh! big glasses of beer. Then what is? What's with the Fred dog? Just stay. Haven't you seen like the glass things with huh? the beer? Like we don't a, have a copy a of this for the Dice Star Library, and I went online to get it, and it's not an easy game to find. Oh, there That's you why go. we picked it up. And we have up. the expansion. So this yay, is, this is Dice Tower Woo! Library. I like Merlin, by the way. I'm surprised that the people. We all like Merlin. Oh, dude. we're you looking at you, Z, to see I if don't you like agree. It, yeah. You don't like you it. You don't like it. I played oh, with you fellas, and I didn't like it. That might have been because Jason wasn't there, though, because Jason would have made me <laughs> like it. <laughs> Join it's the dark good. side, D and Z, and play. Uh, Euros, heavy Euros. I like, he Stephon I like, well, Felt I like is a master. Euros. Not liking the board of this game, but What's the mayor called? of Everson S Springs. So this Whoa. is by the same geometry company, but this is actually not a logic game like the other ones. Sure. Oh, this, this is logo game like the company. The company's logo even is really unfortunately very boring. Yeah, well, it's games by Bright of Sweden. No, I, but they don't even have a logo. It's a dot with the words games across. Games by it. Bright of Sweden. That I think, I think they are uh, sponsored by the government of Sweden. I oh, think that's what they told me. Oh, okay, that makes sense. That one does not look bad. Dice Topia. That sounds awesome. Because oh. as we're dice in it, dice and Topia. Topia is always good when you add Topia. <laughs> What does that even mean? What? <laughs> you can put anything. Mythotopia. Craptopia. Come on now. Yes. Such a <laughs> nerdtopia. Pooptopia. It did get darker in here, right? Yes, it did. Yeah, mm -hmm. it was a lot of glare. Got it. I just look like I got real tanned all of a sudden. Bam. That show the bag. That that looks pretty that cool. Look, that here, put these cool. in the, the shrink once it comes through. A faction pack. Dorktopia over there. What else we got? Serial killer. Yes, calling it mine. It's a bluffing party game. No moderate it, need it. You turn off the lights, but when someone's dead, you got to figure out. I don't know. Who's so, old. so, so basically, I was kidding about that part. Just add milk and oh wait, it's the shortest play time, probably the shortest in the world. LOL. I'm out. <laughs> Again, just add milk and it's good. <laughs> That's hilarious. This looks dumb. If no one responds to the joke, don't say it again. Look at that. The players, eat. 5 to 50 players. 5 to 50? So it's like a... Also, I love how they're saying this is the shortest game in the world. It lists 5 to 30 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> I've played very few games, clearly. It's like they're comparing it to Risk and Monopoly. Sure, but I mean, it could be just as simple of a game. I give everyone a card and you walk them and say, are you a serial killer? Yes. All right, game's over. Start over. You know what I mean? It could be something like that. I'm curious about it. I do like deduction bluffing. Here's V game. Virus from a company called Wisebox. That's the v same company that did Serial same Killer. Same yum yum. <laughs> All right. This All looked right. interesting, but now I'm concerned. <laughs> I okay. don't know. This looks very. I hate to put it that way, but cheap. It just looks kind of cheap. Not a lot of love went into it. I don't mean quality of the. Product actually, the printing on the box just, is cool. Just take this off. That's stupid. <laughs> <laughs> ah! The shrink will not leave. You caught the virus, man. The, ah. the box cover is cool. All right. Not as cool as this, this one. Is <laughs> Come on now. You're not even trying at this point. What oh, is this? It looks good. It looks like a book. A boring book. Oh no, no that's stylish. So are that's you a stylish book. Are, are you judging a book by its cover, sir? No, I am, and there's no way you believe that. That's a cool looking box. No, the side is fine. I'm okay with that. The front, that, it's no It's called way. Libraria. Come on. Uh, the only thing I don't like is the bag. There should be more in the back. In Libraria, players assume the role of librarians who duel oh. for control of the bookshelves while trying to avoid book-eating mice. 
book eating mice? Mice mites. And books? Mites. Oh, oh, mice. mice. No, oh, mice. 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 Rodents. You were, I was, okay, they were right. Got it. It's a complete information game for two players that utilizes modular tiles to ensure an experience that is both deep in strategy and fresh each time you play. I'll probably give it a shot. Let's do it. You and I, let's see who's got the best mice. It sounds like being I just at a might library. surprise you. Pretty boring. <laughs> That's awful. I apologize. Hey, that dungeon duel. Show the back of that box. I think the back actually looks kind of cool. The back does look cool. It looks like some cool green bits that pop on that TV, and then the rest, uh, not so much. Yeah. What's it called? Dungeon. Dungeon. Dungeon dice. duel. I like oh, that. Dungeon, dungeon duel. duel. Yeah. I like that. Base. If you said dice, I would be like, ooh. But dungeon dice already is a game. Yeah. That yes. is nice. Dun, 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 so that's for the Dice Tower that. Library. I love how they have a big box, second edition. <laughs> Isn't the point of the big box to kind of like end it all? No, because they add more. If you bought the first edition big box, too bad. I know, it sucks. That's what I'm saying. I don't care. I don't have the first one. I love Escape. I'm super pumped about this. So you're, you're keeping this. In the Dice Tower Library, yeah. But so that's not, not the only. Us. That's not the only big box coming. Oh, oh! Oh, now this I'm excited about. That one's awesome. Fresco is <laughs> probably the best game about painting out there. That was an yes, incredibly <laughs> narrow statement. Sir. Yeah, but this came out Pointedly the same time. So I don't like <laughs> no, this, this game. No, this game came out. You don't like Fresco? Actually, I haven't played I, this one. You haven't I played Fresco? You played, it's awesome. No, you're thinking of the Eagle Griffin one. I play one where you combine colors and I got a headache. You fresco does yeah, it. Yeah, no, not Fresco. Oh, pastiche. 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 That's the one I played. This, pastiche isn't as good. This pastiche, pastiche is good, good but I, this one's myself. better. <laughs> Stop, you <laughs> dork. Fresco is, the, is one of the best Euro games. Ouch. Sorry Look at for that. your ears. Ten people. modules. Look. We all have made fun of Queen in the past about various things. Who? I don't know. <laughs> you better watch yourself. I love their big boxes because they have a place to store all the modules. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> all those other boxes can't deny. Do you know why we have a bunch of clear meeples in here? Yeah, they're for a fresco. They probably came from some game that it just got tossed. All right, all right, all right. They're cute. you got to show them. Uh, oh my goodness, more big boxes? This is for the library, but I don't really... Uh, Kingdom Builder Big Box, that's pretty awesome. I have to say, I've not played... <laughs> oh, cool. a good catch. I've not played anything from Kingdom Builder past the base game. Now it's good, finally, I heard. <laughs> this is from Vaccarino, I might like it. No. Ah, <laughs> I was troll on top of troll. That's right. I, I remember it. I the first off. time I played Kingdom Builder was at Cool Stuff Hollywood, and that was the first time I was at Cool Stuff Hollywood. I, I remember that before the store burned down. Yeah, it was. The store hasn't burned. Was down. it at the original <laughs> Coast of Hollywood? Or I mean, he was so angry that he torched the place. <laughs> Wait a minute, did not like, happen. I played. This, I think I, I did this. that. Did I think you I eat lunch? <laughs> yes, yeah, but I, mean, I might have been poisoned. He needs a Snickers now, though. <laughs> the virus. <laughs> I got that V virus. The, yeah. The problem is, and I like Dominion, but this is a really boring abstract game. I, I remember really disliking it and just, I just being like completely the, unimpressed. I don't, I don't like hate it. I'd have it. to try it again, it's honestly. Okay. I, might, I might be like, That okay whole single with hand card now. thing, I don't know. But yeah, you know what? No. The Dice Tower Library people, someone in the Dice Tower Library playing this somewhere will enjoy it. Oh, this, yeah, it's awesome. This company is really cool. Did you guys see their booth, the folded space? I they make think those, so, yeah. those yeah. inserts for board games um, that are foam core, but they're yeah. machine cut. They looked really cool. And Is this the a full core dice tower? Yeah. <laughs> yes. That's, That's pretty really sweet. neat. That's pretty sweet. It's like and it'll look light, like yeah. that, yeah. What? Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Race to t I like how you, you pulled bad. your hands back as if you're like, I can't touch that. I can't touch that, man. Da this is the same company from Sweden. From that company again, Games of Sweden. This is the same company for Sweden. Do not try to take your own Again, box, Tom. This is an educational game. Oh, yeah, right, which makes sense. It's an educational we'll move the game. Camera and show the I could see this existing, but I have kids. Uh, I thought maybe this you would touched it. work. I touched it. You touch it, you keep it. Oh, I forgot that we had packed this one. Yeah, I'm taking this home tonight. Wait, wait, even better. Can I open the box cover for a second and show them the other side? Yes, you can. I do remember that. We should have put this in our luggage. Concept right? Kids Animal. Look at this that they signed for us. Oh, uh, what's happening? Have fun with this. No, I said at the end, Kenny, not now. <laughs> wait, wh why are we zoomed in? Oh. He was showing uh, the pile of games so far. All right, go ahead. Go ahead. Oh, we hit 70,000. Woo! 
Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Well, zoom in, Kenny. There we go. Okay, look at this. They, the, the, the author, I mean, not the author, the artist of the game drew this in it just for the copy that we have. This is awesome, Jason. But real quick, why did he, just out of curiosity, pick a hippo? Why not? I don't know. There's a second box with a snake, The Americans are fat. <laughs> he, he gave us two. One's with a snake. So we have a snake and a hippo. I don't know. That's a European version. <laughs> that's, the, that's the pictorial depiction of the dice tower. Yeah. That snake and hippo here. They come again. Oh, boy. But but this is definitely going in the library. Oh, a roll game. Zocken. <laughs> what does Zocken mean? I don't know, but I've heard that is enough like everything. in other games, but I don't know. Look it up. Google. Hey, Siri, Zocken. Zock. Zock it to him. I don't know what it Gamble. means. Gamble. Okay. That makes sense. No rise, no fun. No risk, no fun. Hmm. That looks like an app, almost. What is that? Yeah, Alright, I don't know anything about this. I'm gonna, it looks like From a, the same game? Same company? Brabble. Brabble and, and uh, Gamble. What was the other one? Wow. They literally... They look really boring, just unfortunately. Just changed the C SC into a B. It's Brabble. Mm, I don't know. Well, why I have, do we have, like, a I have a couple of games from Norris, and I do like them. Norris makes good games. They do. Trick-taking ones. Here's a kid's game oh, from Hook. Give me we already saw that. No, this is another witch game. It's a different one. This one, no, the witch it's is... it's the same name. It's the same name. It's the exact it same name. It looks different on the back. Though. It's a different game. <laughs> I think the that the other one's the expansion. Name. Wait, let's find the uh, Klein no, of Hex. The there Klein it is. Hex, uh, yes, right there, the under Band of Monsters. The other thing was, the other thing was an expansion then. Must okay, be. here we go. Now let's compare them. Wait, Are they the same the game? game? Wait a minute, what is going on here? This is different. Maybe that is an expansion. Look, this must be a property. This must be a book or something. They're definitely different games. I they don't are know different now. games, yes. Yes, because this is two to four for 15 minutes. This one's two kids. to four for 20 based minutes. Based on the children's book classic. So it's they're both games. Man, I'm that a are beast, based son. Children's book. I am a beast. How did I call that? Am I a genius, Jason? Toot my horn. You read the back of the box Hell. before we did. <laughs> it's in German, man. Come on, I can't read. Here's English. In English, I can't English, read. I can't read. I just said. Here's Ringo. It's part of a four, four set. Ringo yeah. looks cool. Here we go. Uh, <laughs> It's probably the star of the box. <laughs> Get out of here, homie. What? This looks boring. Come on, man. Mine was know. better than his. I think Z. that was oblique. Z. They were both good. They were both equally good, guys. You're, hey, you're fun. You're both great comedians. So are you going to drum up interest for this ah! game? <laughs> that was all right. All That's right. Good. Drum up interest. Yeah. yeah I don't except get it. it. Stop it. All right. Boom. Actually, that game looks good. Bring it I back. get it. Rainbow <laughs> Star, the drummer of the Beatles. Okay, yes, I get it. Okay. Sam's looking at me like I'm an idiot, Tom. It looks like an interesting abstract game, okay? We got too caught up in stupid puns. Sorry. Here comes Here's the, the English nice game. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't sing that song. That was George Harrison. He drums in it, though. <laughs> All right. This game looks like it's a wine bottle box, but it's not. That company has now been making boxes That's a small like that. Wine bottle oh, hell, beat. Deal now, maker. Weren't these guys working with Asmode carried them for a while, but I don't think they do what anymore. What company? I don't think so. Um, fast and job. Helvetic, negotiating Hel Helvetic game. or whatever. They make a couple games I really like, oh, and then Helvetic. they make a lot of games I don't. They make a lot of little bizarre games. Yes. I don't know anything about this one. They've been making a lot of Canizia games. Is Canizia too? No. Nah, I don't Alan. want to think of the fast and wild negotiation game. Alan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're not even halfway, are we? Zach. Right. Zach, Zach, Zach! So what's Zach Another versus Norse Zach? Another game. Hmm? I don't know. Word games. Hey, it's Is Michael Shock. It is Michael yeah, Schock. He's good. I used good. to mean word something game. back in the day. It still Ooh, does. It's all in German now. I don't know if we'll yeah, be able right. to play it. It's a German word game. There's probably English rules in here. It's still a German word game. Oh, yeah, Don't right. care if there's English rules in it or not. Ooh. I want to play this Karate one. This is from Amigo. Karate Tomate. Karate Tomate. No, it looks fun. It's a... Uh, Karate Tomate. Oh. Yes, you said Amigo. it right. It's Canizia. It's probably a remake of an older game. <laughs> you bet. <laughs> that is probably very true. All right, this looks good. This is the kind of thing that that's, looks awesome. that's silly and goes over well. Karate Tomate. You go. Oh, my. One to nine. What is the deal with these guys? 
What's wrong with that? That looks nice. It colorful. looks like Uno cards. Look, they can put this in Toys R Us after it comes back, but I don't know. It just doesn't really brain it. All right, here's this for a different audience. Here's some stuff for Sam. You no, know, it's okay. It's for a different Ooh. audience. Is that the one he was excited about? Sword no. Sorcery, <laughs> Darkness Falls, and Arcane Portal. These are not the ones that Tom said you were excited about. I just don't know what that but is. But this is more monsters, more. Does it start with an R? I don't know what it is. Scenarios. When are we going to get some games, man? Man, I'm going to go games over there. Oh, pile of, like little You want some games. chocolate with mint creme? Review like 15 of them in one day. No, homie. Oh. Now this. That looks awesome. Hands down, I would beat you at. No way you're faster at one of these than I am. No, I'm not. We know this from when we played Zoo, the zoo That's game. That's right. You lost at that Mesozoic. You're bad at something? You have, well, I collected all the right He's cards, like but then to slide them into the places took forever, and I couldn't cool. do it right. That looks mechanical. But, it, but the problem is, these these do all fall in that same category, that's right? I mean, that's a, sliding puzzles nah, are really that's awesome. Kind of a sliding puzzle, Sli yeah. What, did you just say sliding puzzles are really awesome? <laughs> they are. I agree with them. You need to learn some more words that mean good. Like good. Here's Kang, which is short for something. Um, it's like baby Kong, kangaroo. Guys, come on, <laughs> fellas. Fellas, please. Y'all bunch of idiots. Uh, oh, whoa, oh, oh, whoa, oh, oh. whoa, whoa. This is the... Um, what is it? Yeah, this is the reprint for... Um, Gaijis or Gijes or whatever, that abstract game. Oh, really? L let you me don't see. know what that is, or do you? That's what this is. A themed reprint of that. Did you ever play that game? Yeah, I'm trying. I don't know if I played it, but I know what you're talking about. Yeah, this is what that is. Oh, Once Upon a Castle. Now this one has me oh, super yeah. pumped. Once Upon a Castle. Ooh. This game. You're oh, Jason, you're like a pa weirdly trained parrot. I. You're drawing a castle piece by piece. No, no. Look. This one looks... Oh, it's a drawing game. This one looks good. Although, if you can draw that well, you automatically win. Yeah, really. Okay, drawing is awesome, too. <laughs> what else no. we got? All right. Blue Orange always has creative games. Ninja Rush with timers. <clears throat> Sam, look how big that ninja is, though. Wow. He ain't hiding anywhere. I guess it's oh. got to be a first player. No, there's two. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> yeah, flip it over. The back, it shows like they're like in a. This, is a, this must be a speed game. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. Jason's allergic to castles. <laughs> or drawing. I think this is the kids' box, by the way, guys. Oh, this is awesome. Curly color. Curly color. You're rolling this snail down a chute trying to knock stuff over. That's what? awesome. What? Look at that. All right, cool. You roll it down and you set all these guys up and you knock them over. Come on, I'm on, I'm in this one. This one I'm looks, seeing a Bruno Fiduli. This one looks I mean, cool. a Bruno Catala game coming up. Forget that one. This ninja game looks cool. It's got sand timers. Come on, They're man. Awesome Bruno too. Catala. Ooh, that was one I was excited about. Just put that in the middle, Tom. Wait a minute. Did you like any of the other folding games? No. Did you play them? I played. First one again. This falls in the same category as Image talking about. You got to fold the thing up as fast as you can. I like it. So this but must be the original designer. Yeah. Bruno and then Bruno Katana came in. What is this Supposedly called? Supposedly there's a game Magic to it now. Gold. Magic gold. <laughs> That's me. That is you. That is you, Z. No, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> I talked to Bruno. He said that's you. No, it's not. Okay. I yeah, talked to Bruno. Yeah, it's one of those folding. Uh, hey, Otter. Good to see you. One of those folding Who? things, and you have to show the pattern. Otter Kramer Fresner. said, I miss Essen, great stream. Oh, cool. There you go. Yeah, this is, again, a very divisive game because of that folding thing. I love the folding games. All right, are they here awesome? is Professor they Evil are. and Architects of Magic. This is an expansion for I'm the game. For that. Did you play the original one? Yeah. Well, I didn't know that. Uh, what did you, what'd you think of it? I liked it. I played Solitaire only so far. I've never, I just tried it. I like it. It's, it can be, you can just lose. Sure, I guess, but I thought the puzzle was neat. Mm -hmm. Turning stuff off, running around. I, mean, I liked it. No, yeah. I liked it too. It's getting strong. Well, here's a new one. This is good. Zwoggle. Zwoggle. English rules included. Good. It looks like an abstract strategy game where you're the... putting uh, tiles in order. Yeah, from the same company as uh, that other one we saw with the rings. Huh. Yes. 
This is they this do a lot of these little abstract games. They are real hit and miss. This is the second game from Klaus Jargon Raid. Blocks. And it says based on the video game classic. I don't know if I've ever played the video game Blocks unless it was called Tetris and Nerd. Blocks. No, those aren't. It's a, it's a roll and write and you draw and you fill in the stuff. No, I know that, but it says it's based on a classic video game. I don't think I've ever played a video game oh, called Blocks. I did. I think we've. I think I've played that. This actual game? Yeah, it was called Tetris Blocks. No, 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 no. It's Tetris. I think I played this at, at, at Essen. Oh, okay. Really? Oh, probably Suzanne had it. Su Suzanne did have it. She had it on the cruise, too. It looks neat. You, you, um, you cover up these different things, and it gives you points, but there are some places that give you negative points if you cover them up or something to that effect. I so can't it's kind of like the Knizia game, it sounds like. Yes. Here's another... Hel these little games from Helvetic always make me think of Oink. Mm -hmm. They're yes. that same kind of style. This one's called... Winston. It looks like you're making long dogs. Did Winston Churchill have a dog? Adrenaline team play. DLC. Downloadable content. I mean, I'm, I'm interested in this. The, the thing I like best about this, Vernon, if you're watching, is I don't think this miniature needs any painting at all. It's pretty much perfect as is. Wow. Yeah, yeah. I don't think it line, needs painting either, Vernon. Wink. Wink, hope, wink, wink. Line and sink, right? No, he painted his, I think. He did. Are you um, paying, he paints everything. I wonder if he's ever been tempted to paint a card. <laughs> so what does DLC you know what I mean? stand I'm for? I'm pretty sure. No. I'm pretty sure I just painting. People paint cards. Yeah, it's called yeah. oil painters. Jerry, Jerry told us no. Jerry told us about how he has a a deck of cards. Magic or like cards. Magic the Gathering, people paint over their own artwork yes. with new something yeah. or other. And they're yeah, worth yeah. like tens of thousands of dollars. That's crazy. Like that. yeah, so right, heads up, this box has mo the most games so far. What is box. DLC? This is the box for wait, me. Wait, wait. What does DLC actually mean? Down Downloadable, Downloadable content. content. You mean it's, it uses so what, an app? I'm, I'm curious. Oh, what dork. field of work do you work in right now? Television. And... We don't have DLCs on our television, but that is cool. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but you play video games, right? Okay, anyway. Yeah, but... This strategy game is called Going Around the City, which really makes it sound like a little kid's book. Going Around the City. First we'll stop at the post office. It doesn't really show anything on the box about the game. I think it is a kid's... It, it looks like a kid's game. Or a lunchbox. I'm sorry, there's only one thing I think of when I... See that? Ah, this is, I always like getting these. This is the long pack games designer pack that has oh, all. Oh yeah, yeah. It has a bunch of like card sleeves and sample dice, sample meeples, whatever. And that's these cool. are cool. Opening these up is neat. I like the name of this one. Get the gun and shoot the snitch. <laughs> <laughs> the snitch. That's what it's called. Get no. the gun. No, it's called just the it's snitch. It's called the snitch. Oh, it's like, get okay. the gun, shoot the snitch. <laughs> Jeez. And there's a cardboard gun in it, right there, and then a bunch of cards. And brass knuckles. Uh, escape a maximum security prison with your fellow inmates by smuggling a gun inside. Work together and use your prison contacts cleverly. But beware, at any moment one of your associates might become the snitch. If he foils your pa painstaking plans, he wins. Or maybe there's no snitch at all. It's a hidden traitor game. Okay. Sure, the theme's a little... It works. Hey, works. Grandma! Are you the snitch? <laughs> I'm gonna shoot you. Uh, it looks well done. I'll tell them. I'll, I'll give it that. It looks well illustrated. You know, well finalized. I, I don't remember what company gave this. Right, to the us, next game is called cool. High Score. What that means, Jason, is if someone does better than everyone else in a video game, they get the high score. They have the yeah. high score. I remember 80s video games like oh, Pac-Man. Okay. Look, that. That's so anything like, oh, okay, that's true. DLC is a fairly new concept. It's within the last eight years or ten years. Yeah. Right. Okay. Jason hasn't played a video game. That's true. Since you don't. You don't play. You don't play like modern video games at all, do you? <laughs> Except I rock played band? Madden and Rock Band we played. Well, and he saw that Nintendo 64 the other day. almost lost his mind. <laughs> <laughs> Remember that? No, I do have a PS4. You're like, oh my goodness, a Rumble Pack? No, is I it out of the trick yet? Oh, wait, is this? Now it is after we played Rock <laughs> Band. <laughs> That's crazy. You had it just sitting around. Yeah. yeah. I, I know I played a game from DMZ before, and I don't I don't remember what it was, though. Uh, that's a demilitarized that zone. Is that escaping North Korea? <laughs> yeah. All right. Crime Hotel. That is a reprint, trick-taking uh, reprint of 
the little Can game I from Hisashi Hayashi detail. that's a deduction trick taking game. Do you game. like the original? I haven't played it yet. What deduction trick taking game did he make? I don't know. The one where you like have a board and as you take the tricks, you discard the cards and you have to guess what the missing cards are. I gotta say oh, I like this yeah. box a lot. I forget what it's called. Looks like a sandwich. I forget what the other one's called. It's the Crime same game. Crime Hotel. I know, it says it right there in English. Wait a minute. I, know. I feel a, a trend coming on from the other game. What to wear? <laughs> sorry. That's been the I'm same going game. around the city. These, these are children's games. Color game. Wait, wait, even better. Monsters Party. Mon a what to wear to the Monsters Party. It was a Monsters Party. It was a party. Though. Akaraki, the Java Herbalist. Is this a, this is from? Uh, like this looks good, actually. Herbalist looks, Java. Yeah, that see. does look, the cover of it looks. You are cool. an herbalist. Okay, here, let's pass it down. Huh? Maybe. This looks are you cute. Making herbalist coffee, herbal coffee, herbal tea, Java. This is the Java herbalist. Maybe you use I've coffee to uh, heal coffee. people. Huh? Maybe use coffee. I'm I'm not being. Facetious. <laughs> we to clarify that a no, lot. No, but he's he's from Java. That's you know on the back. It's Javanese. Is, is he making coffee or tea? I'm really confused. I assume tea. I'm not sure. Herbal ingredients. Coffee's bad for you. Tea is good. Especially herbal tea. This looks good. I like the cover. Pretty sure all tea is. Uh, and anyway, he's got a bunch of roots and stuff like ginger and whatever that is. Yeah. All right. This game is called Biblia. But there's like no English, it's all Korean. It looks like it's stuff from the Bible, but really bad drawings. Biblia? Biblia. It's David and Goliath. I know what it is, Kenny. What? <laughs> Kenny, it's called like, Biblia. That's Bible. That's yeah, the Caribbean is actually a reference to the pirates. Biblia, of the Bible board game. It actually says it on here. <laughs> All right, keep it going. What else All we got? Right. Give me some good stuff. Stangle? I haven't drafted you just, anything you yet. You just said you like that other thing. I that want came something by. that's so hot that I'm like, ooh, I can't even let Sam. This is or from Jason Jakarta. Touch you know what it was? All your games that you like are so small, you were able to fit them in the suitcase when we brought, brought them back. I actually brought very few small back, games yeah. back with me. Not a lot of small games came back. This is interesting. You need to keep the peace and and in, in your neighborhood. Like, I don't want that, man. I want to give about demons and chaos. <laughs> See, this is why you have the worst taste in theme. I want to so, see a so. game in which I have to, like, go around shooting neighbors. The art of Batik. Shooting neighbors? Good. Not my neighbors. What is Batik? I think it's an area, but this has a... I hate this. It's another from the company. Yeah, this is... I do like their box to use covers. The same graphic design on this one. Right? Yeah, but it feels different. I mean, all joking aside, these games feel like something different. I'm excited about 45 that. 45 to 90 minutes. So I'll just play for 45 and I'm done. Oh, I hate that. Can I do like a side actual unboxing as you keep going through all this crap? No. What? No, Sam. I, I mean, I'm just gonna, you know, start Fields of Green up. expansion. Fields of Green expansion. You gotta do it on camera, man. Fields of Green I, I expansion. I will be right here. Like, no, like, that's no, not a Sam. Get that flooping game out of here. Flooping game? What does oh, that mean? Flooping here. Hey, wait, we didn't show off Grand Fair. We that did much. show it, Grand Fair. Wow. Show nice. it off. This nice. I haven't seen. I haven't heard about this one at all. From Blue Orange. Slide your buzz plane on your finger. Pick a card to land on. Close your eyes and aim for the Grand center. Fair. Oh, so here's what this game is. You put the plane on your finger, and then I close my eyes and I'm like, yeah, did I land on the target? I'm dead. Are you serious? When your I'm finger serious. like it goes it's on, you know, it's a ring. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that I see. I like dexterity games. I feel like we might have this and one it's in flipping. our. We have this one already. King Stride. King Struggle. Like, don't it's from Robert Burke. Wiz Kids. The art is really dark, and I don't mean by like Z Garcia likes it dark, but as in just uh, that. That artist though is one of my absolute favorite artists. Really? Yeah, the same person who did Bloody In and. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't know. I find them too, like I said, too dark. I just feel I like there's not enough. I love that look. This is by Robert Burke, huh? Yeah. I do feel like maybe we've had that before. I can't recall. Yeah, no, because this was it. new. I remember Rolling new. Bandits. Oh, dice. This is like the blue orange box. Actually, Sam, this looks like one you may not dislike. Look at the back. Rolling Bandits? That does sound cool. That and sounds it's a train awesome, game. in fact. 
No, right, it just Jason? sounds cool. Whoa, you changed up your word usage? I'm scared. Rolling bandits. Rolling this one, looks, bandits. This one doesn't have any English on it. Looks like it's all Italian, but. Road. The long road. Sam's I do like the cover. Oh, the dice no, no, are no, no, cool. No, I'm just trying okay, to. Okay, I'm going to look at this while Sam's get it, looking at get that. It to close. This, this one looks really cool, Rolling well, Bandits. I'm going to look at that. Somebody opened cool. this game, or did they give it to us like. That, you look at your own game! Why are you they looking probably at mine? Come and not your neighbor's game! Of it, not thy neighbor's game. Uh, it's an Italian. I don't know anything about it, but it looks neat. Here, I speak Italian. So I don't care. You do speaking. not. Do you really? If you don't read it, it doesn't matter. No, no. <laughs> you are so matter of fact. You do not. Do you really? Be scusi. This looks good. Oh wow, Is that I like that. Okay, I what like else? Look at this. Do you speak any languages other than English? No. Oh, I don't know. I would. And I'm I work, American, and, no. And I, work, and I work at a Spanish company. You don't even speak Spanish, right? And you work for them. Yes. Uh, this is good. Macbeth. This one looks pretty good, actually. Although the artwork is... It falls in that almost too cartoony style. But Gen X makes some pretty good games. Henekis. Yes. Gen X does make good games. Okay. I think that might be good enough to close the game now. Fair as That's fell. I don't know. Man, Sam, the number of Korean games that have passed over this table today <laughs> yeah, has been quite I really quite don't high. like this hard work. You don't like that cartoony? Nah. Do you? That's like Mad Magazine almost. Uh, For yeah. Macbeth, it should be serious. It's like comic strip cartoon yeah. artwork. I don't like it, yeah. What's with the... Wait, wait. There's a USB... Yeah, and, and one of the ladies is carrying a chainsaw. So what? And a laser... Uh, yeah, like a Ghostbuster thing over here. So come on. Where are the <laughs> the USB thing is the one That's thing. That's the only thing I noticed. Yeah. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> so this isn't even like real Macbeth. No, it's not. This okay, one looks I hate fun. The name, then the Spring Rally wind up car. I mean, they're not wind up cars, but you have a wind up thing on them. Oh. Okay. That's that's a neat looking thing. That's oh, cool. that is cool. It looks like a film strip or something. Oh, sorry. That's it's why. Mandu again. Mandu. All right. This looks cute. I like that. Those are Tamagotchi cars. Oh, uh, okay. I don't know. That's got a surface. You know what a Tamagotchi is? <laughs> that little pet thing. Yeah. That had a screen like that, you know? Got it. Uh, oh, I hated those. Those were kids were like walking around like, oh, my pet's hungry. I now like, we all do it as grown ups with our phones, so. I don't feed my phone. I don't look at my phone every five. Hang on a second. Yeah. I'll, let me let's, let me see the last time I looked at it. You didn't play Pokemon Go either, did you? Oof. Super villain, this galaxy is mine. Hi, homie. This game has infinite combos. <laughs> Actually, yeah. seventy-five thousand. I am I am interested in this in this one. How is it possible for a game that is contained mm -hmm. to have infinite combos? Because. You command Shut billions of minions. You command Here, billions to the other of side minions. And the back. I mean, that is that is a lie. <laughs> the fact that it is contained within a box. Oh, we have this one. What is it? It's great. Since this you're getting excited. Called, now this is called pepper, pepper, pepper and. Oh, that does carrot. sound good. That's based on a uh, online comic called Pepper and Carrot, which I really like. Super cute. I really liked it. It's just a silly... You know, wow, that looks like a nice cover. She's like some apprentice witch who goes to live with these three and older witches. And Carrot is the cat's name. I yeah. So I don't know. It's like... I don't know if the game's good. I know this was a Kickstarter. I remember I remember talking about it when it was on Kickstarter. But I'm hoping it's a good game because I like the theme and the art a lot. I like the art. That looks good. That also, Pepper stands for pirates. <laughs> or she is wearing a pirate outfit. Thieves. The most exciting <laughs> game of strategy and chance is what it okay. says. Oh, I'm even going to say that box looks boring. This, gosh, but look, why? you can see the board. The board That's a dragon's boring. lair. Okay. It looks like it. Okay, next. No, the box is elegant looking. No, it looks boring, Sam. No, actually, I, I agree elegant. with, I I mean, agree I with like Sam. The, the box looks yeah, fine. The bag is an elegant. The no, board no, no, no. is like... Oh, board, board, board. You can see the this board like four times on the cover. Yeah, but you don't know it's the board. Cover. You don't know it's the board. <laughs> Until you flip it over, right. you go, it's the board. <laughs> Ambar. Ambar. Didn't we get some games from this company before? Invaders. Invaders. 
I feel like I've seen some other stuff yeah, they made, and I remember it being, if I recall correctly, high quality components, which has me excited. But wait, 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 wait. wait. Sorry. This artwork looks like that game. Do we not need to open that one bag now? No. Uh, isn't this a reprint? It probably is. Who cares? How many? Let's do one with fewer games for the next one so that Sam doesn't kill yeah, us. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is a reprint. Nobody cares. Of a game I can remember in which you were Let collecting me Amber. See. Let me see. Maybe I could figure it out. I owned that game for a while. See, let me see it. I might be, be able quiet. to figure it out. Yeah, quiet, let's, homie. Let's see. Let, let him see it. I haven't <laughs> seen the back. I don't know what it is. Get to him. Ambar is. Huh. Re implements what? It doesn't say, but I feel it like I played this game also. It doesn't look like you're. Click the designer. I did. He also Amber designed. Root? Is that what it was called? Amber Root? Yeah, but that's not. He didn't design it. It really Amber looks Root. like that. I played Amber Root. That's, it that's does. a different game. Hard work looks it's similar. Not. He, this guy did a game called Castle Cards Cthulhu Crusades. That's for you. Uh, those are both. Really bad from what I understand. All right, anyway, All right, Hand Circus! Do, 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 Is this Chris do, 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 do. Handy's game? No, it's actually for some... It's, it's a... It's a Kore I want to say it's, oh, it's from Gemblo. No, 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 and no, no. Chris Sam, Handy did a game called Gemblo. Handy. This is the guy who did... Who also did the Marble Bob Sled that we were playing all over the place. And this one you have to do like... It's just in um, what, well, whatever his last name is. Just you have to know. make like hand symbols and hold things between your hands. It sounds really cool. All right. Speaking of cool, this one actually really does look cool. Trappist One. It's also from Gen X, a new solar system. Uh, if you look at the uh, back, that looks really neat. Hmm. That does look neat. Nice. Yeah, I'd, yeah, yeah. I'd, That's I'm, cool. I'd play that one. You played it? I said I'll play that one. Trap. Trappist One. Okay. All right, then we got the Crimson Company. We've got that kicking around somewhere yeah, already. Yeah, I think we do. All right, Yay. moving on. Polar Party. We're in a little bit of a kid's route here. Polar Party looks cool. Penguins are good. Oh, wow. this is the one that I heard about with the crinkled paper. Like it has uh, polar ice, I guess, and it's made from, I think, crinkled paper or something. It's really cool looking. My kids are going to like this. I just realized, I just remember one of these boxes as a Christmas present for my kids. <laughs> oh, shoot. Uh, go, go, Eskimo. Go, go, Eskimo. Go, go, Eskimo Warm. It's a Kinesia game. Is it a reprint? Uh, I don't know. It, I mean, they usually what do you are. Think? I wouldn't have guessed it was a Kinesia from the moving the things along. What do you think it is a reprint of? Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, it's a guess. I don't know. <laughs> lost cities. A board lost game. cities. Actually, it could be a, a dumbed down version of Lost Cities, the board game. Maybe. With four Eskimos running around a board? Sure. It says it's a new game here. It says the. Mm hmm. Oh, never mind. Okay. This one looks interesting. Vol. Have fun trying to say that name. Folston. Folston. But look at the pieces. They look pretty cool. Oh, they're neat. They are neat. That's because Zock always they're puts the out really good wood. They're the longest dice in the world. The fifth element. Oh, they're dice. Do you place one in the <laughs> pillar at the end and then? <laughs> I, I like I like Zock games. They're usually made of nice wood. There was a there was a card in uh, one of the games that I just got through unboxing this morning, that it had like a very Lilo, uh -huh. uh, looking character on it, and it was called Multipath. Like P A T H instead. Yeah, 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 was, yeah. was Stitch in it also? No, oh. we're not. That's okay. a different movie, Jason. Lilo, not Lilo. Multipass. Multipass. <laughs> Lilo Dallas. Sam's favorite. Sam's favorite. A Sam's bell. Favorite board game. Oh god. Now, do we have this one already? I, oh, I don't know if we have it, but this one's one that uh, we'll put in the kids section of our library. Speed Cups. You ever played this? No. I like Speed Cups a lot. You just you flip over a card that shows these things in that order, and then you, and you gotta flip, stack them, and you gotta stack your cups as quickly as you okay. can. It's fun. Sounds good. All right, I asked Kenny to give me a box here full of bigger games. That's the because the first one's called Big Bang. Funny, Kenny. Funny. Big Bang. Big games. Sure. This one has a game called Big Bang. Uh, I'm not sold on this one. I mean, it's colorful, and then you take a closer look and realize that's the board. It's from the same company as that other one. 
invaders. It might be good. It might be good, yeah. But so might that Speed Cups game, though I doubt it. You know what I'm saying? What is this one called? Forwarder of Xanadu? Of Xanadu. What is it? Wow, that's a... It's a heavy game. I heard something It's Manifest about Destiny. I heard a little bit about this, but I don't recall if what I read was Why doesn't it... Positive, it doesn't negative. like... Well, I, Manifest Destiny puts out some heavy euros. They put out um, the Alchemy one. Remember that Alchemy one? And that was a small game, though. No, it wasn't. Yeah, I think Ooh, it was. The, the one know? with the work replacement where you had a bunch of pawns. Yeah. It was a small box. It was a heavy game. Yeah. It was a small box. This is a big box. Heavy game. Right. Way to work their way on the rope, baby. Yes. Are you guys done? Are you guys done? Baby. <laughs> you don't go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me, Jason, like that. I know my games, son. Okay, this All does right, look this good. This is Roll and Wall. This, uh, this I'm excited about. This is a dice tower in it. Yes. Yeah. Jesus. Why does that bother you? It's loud, and we are all wearing microphones. Oh, yeah, okay, sorry, sorry, sorry. This does oh, look cool. Oh, yeah. That does look fun. It does. Plus, I like Grana. I, I like Grana, too. I like their stuff. They're awesome. I like the cover. I don't know. Oh. cover looks good, too. There's another one I'm super pumped about. I think. Like that, right? The right way. I don't know if it's good enough, but I'm pumped about it, Tom. X code. Well, I like Amigo stuff in general. Is that okay? Dork. Dorkus no, Maximus has, Aurelius. It has these different codes here and numbers right. and, and timers and a time and cracking app. The, breaking code and stuff. Well, I hope that it's not too. Like, I hope that if there is an app needed, that it's in English because. I can get English rules for these games, hopefully. Oh, it's the app. an app game? Even better. I well, like Well, I don't know. It says games. timer app here in German. It's just a clock. We call it a clock. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Here's a game that the, the front looks awful. Athens, like... I've seen this before. Yeah, I think... No, I think we saw this as a prototype. I'm almost positive. I'm pretty sure that's still a prototype from that Yeah, but look. the back looks really good. That's my style game, Athens. Uh, Okay, take a closer look. The cards are colorful and interesting. I like yeah, how they I'll look. Take a closer look here. Uh, pass. That's okay. No one asked you to review it. Woo! Tenth anniversary, Dixit. Uh, this took a little bit of a beat. Tenth here, anniversary, huh? Dixit. That's okay. We're just gonna pull the cards out and trash the box. Now, what is what is in here? The original release? No, special tenth anniversary cards. It's in French. How would I know? Special 10th anniversary I don't cards. recognize any of these cards, but that doesn't mean anything anymore. The only yeah, card that true. I remember is that big troll taking a little kid in the cave because of that one game we played. I don't remember that, but okay. These are... They, these look new. They are new. Oh, they, this looks they neat. told me it's all new cards. Pocket sub. I wouldn't eat that. <laughs> what? So, a sub, sub you, you keep can, in your pocket. Sub you can fit in your pocket? That's the deluxe edition, too. This looks nice. See, that sounds cool. <laughs> tiles. You're tra traversing with your little submarines there. The tiles sort of are broken oh, up into different areas. I'm super psyched for the next one. That's I'm ridiculous. I'm super psyched for the next one. You guys are all going to hate this, East but I'm super Indian psyched. Man. This what? is This is Heavy Euro, an awesome Heavy Euro from what I hear. Wait, you haven't played it? Then how do you You're know? You're out, Tom. Because Tony's played it like 20 times already. Well, then I automatically know I don't like it. That's why I said this This one is my kind oh, of game. Let me see. Hold on. I might like it. Hold on now. Uh, no. It's a playing time over an hour. You Ages don't like 12 it. 12 and up. Two to four players. 60 to 90 minutes. 90 minutes for a game? Woo! East India Man is supposed to be amazing, though. Back bubble. This now. This I'm With a booster like. pack? <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. What is in here? Food? What is this? I'm assuming it's dice. Oh, this is messed pack up. Pack um. Oh, look at this! Sam. One board, thirteen marble stones, seven wooden dice. Oh, this it, looks like that other game, doesn't it? Mm. It does. It does. Yeah. I don't know anything about Wait, this bird again. It, does oh. Peck Vogue? Does Peck Vogue you know, go with like the whole? Play it. The other Kinesia game. Remember the Kinesia games like yeah, the where you eat the worms? Or, yeah, or I wonder Pecomino, if this is whatever in that you want to series. All right, Sam. Sam, I don't know if you've ever played Quartermaster General. Have you? Yeah. Did you like it? Yeah. I there love Quartermaster General. 
That's, yep. That I sounds. Picked, I picked this up. Um. <laughs> Bad Castro. Cuba Libre. I Fidel Castro. I love their games. Huh. Z has already reviewed this one. You've already reviewed it and played it. That's for Dice Tower no, Library, Z. Oh. No, wait. We already have a copy of Dice Tower Library. Then that's for Z, Z. <laughs> that's for Z, Z? Top. This looks... Quartermaster is great. There you go. What is that? What is this? Geekbox, baby! Oh. Very happy. Okay. Whoa. No, we ran out of them. We put them in our games and they're out. What so is Geekbox? So those little plastic container boxes that I store all my components in. Oh. And so I uh, this I get them by the, the crate. This is for the library. Oh, more big box. Oh, yeah, baby. Alhambra Don't worry, big box. Alhambra. Yeah, but this is the, I thought we got the bigger Alhambra box. There's a new one that has Maybe more stuff in it. Maybe they give us both? I don't remember. This looks to be the same thing you already this have. This is the same thing. All right, well, that's still cool. I'm going to switch it out for mine. Here's Concept Kids. Oh, we wait, show the snake. Show, show the, the other snake. Artwork. Oh, the snake is better. The than snake Whoa. is cool. Snake is, I like the hippo, but the snake is wait, cool. Wait, what did he write about the snake? What did Gareth write about the snake? Have fun with Concept. <laughs> that's it. What did you want? He drew a <laughs> snake you, in it, man. What did you want him to say? But like, he did draw that I awesome snake. Jason. This looks awesome. He did draw the awesome snake. How cute. That's a good. That's a good game that adapts well to a kid's concept. <laughs> wow. I Did you baby. buy hats and you? And no, put them in someone, there? someone gets me. It's, okay. it's a little baby. small. I'm gonna give it to my son. Oof. Well, it's a felt. It Thank you, Tom. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> actually I see a wee leprechaun. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 Okay, enough of these hats. No, leave it on, man. That looks good on you. Yeah, we need hats. Fine. The next one that comes out of a box, you have to wear. Yes, yeah, Sam, you're forced no. to wear a hat now. Oh, my. If I'm forced to wear one, you're forced to wear one. The face? The faceless. Now this. The faceless. The faceless. Oh, I didn't even see the list was in the darker. Now this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that doesn't look evil at all. Not at all. <laughs> Do you know anything about it? <laughs> oh, it's yeah, like an abstract. Yeah, it's an abstract strategy game, it looks like. Oh. Well, Sam, what did you want? You wanted like the theme anyway. So, so it's the faceless and the themeless. <laughs> the themeless, nice. I don't know. Yeah. Oh, we did get a copy of this. Yes, we did. Of course, I got that. Come well, on, nice. I love it's that heavy. game. Well, yeah, I don't want to hear no. Of course, we did. And so I pull a Cavern expansion out here, and you've been punching okay. me for two months straight. That Cavern would be good. expansion won't be in this box. I'm sorry. What is in here? It comes with the, you know, the thing was cardboard. Now it's, it's a plastic, a plastic now. thing. Get out! It's plastic That's now. Nice. Yeah, it's really cool. Horrible oh, games. I see it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the little tunnels right there. It's Horrible plastic. games is pretty awesome. That's gorgeous, man. Wow. Do I have to say the app that they came out with kind of kills the game? Again, I don't understand that. It's a game based on an app. Of course the app's going to be. Yeah. The app, was, the app is good. Sam, I think you might be interested in this one. Looks good. Maybe that does look cool. Flying you saw the back machines. of it? The, no. It has a bunch of, I'm being careful, a bunch of, you're flying airplanes back and forth yeah. like a race. Uh, Richard Denning is one of the two guys who runs the uh, UK Games Expo. Yeah. Mm. Oh, okay. It's well, a cool theme. Yeah. Are there more geek boxes? No. Could it possibly be food? Oh, really? Please don't say those are like the sausages. If the sausages sound like that, <laughs> they're probably you should not be good. Them. They're expired, I think. Yeah. <laughs> that, I'm that, glad we clarified that. That one I would buy on camera if we hydrated. Make sure this is something we can put on camera. Okay. Oh, it's a game. It's a game in a box. Why is it in a box? Something fall. The brigade. Welcome to it's Tinder very Box. Well packed. Well, that's kind of a cool cover. The Brigade. That's the expansion. That's the expansion. Wait. Uh. Oh look, that other thing we're looking that for. That other thing thing goes with oh, this. It's like a puzzle. It's like an escape room. Oh! I remember this. On what was on Kickstarter, you are trying to be. A uh, hero to put out the fire. There's like a fantasy city. It's on fire. So you're going around trying to put out more fire than everybody else. Well, I'm gonna put it out if it's a fantasy city. No, look at look at look at the, look at that. It looks cool. That does look cool. That I does look cool. I want to put out the city's fire if it's a real city, not a fantasy city. <laughs> like if London was burning, that's never happened. But 
If London was burning, you know, then yeah. Or just a small building like you could get. Here he comes to troll the day! <laughs> yep. This does look cool. This looks good. I agree. Looks hot. Don't we have this on a shelf somewhere? I think I did. You have yes. this on your shelf. Yes. Animale Tatica. There's no English rules. Wow. Not that you know, because they blacked out a lot. Oh, oh there's wait, English wait, that rules. Is English. Too bad you said no English rules. Well, the one I had on the shelf, or have on the shelf, has no English rules. Sucker, we got to one with English rules. Scuba Sea Saga. You realize it's like literally five feet away and you can get to it. <laughs> okay. Oh, I was going to say it's a scuba game, but then I looked at the back and went, oh, no. There's an app. That looks like an iPad. Right? Oh, yeah. wait. This is the yeah, game yeah, yeah. where they said the app, you need the app to play the game. I do remember this. Uh, why is... Wow. This is for the Buy library? One? No, someone came and gave it to us. Oh, nice. Uh, yes. Unfortunately, the box took a severe beating. Huge beating. <sighs> yes, this was the one Jeez. with the app. But, and the only problem with this one, and look, that's Ooh. pretty awesome. Ooh, fifth and sixth. The only problem with this is that those encounter cards are in, Eng are in German. Mm. So, so I'll have to get English encounter cards. But I still have my copy. I told you this. We can Frankenstein the two copies. You, we did say this at Essen. Yeah. I remember that. Frankenstein. This is a great game. We, we just ch talked about it in our best games in 99 and 98. Yep. It, Starfarers of Catan. And it's going to be in the Dice Tower Library. The Color Monster. I don't want to throw this one because if I, I throw this on the floor. This. Oh, this there one is really cool There was something interesting too. about this that caught my eye. I forget what it was. It's um, all about talking about your feelings. Yes. It, it, I think maybe that's what it was. It was this like sort of educational game that seemed... Do um, you have feelings? It is. Yes. Yeah, sure. Z doesn't. No. Like, do I personally feel emotions? Is yes. what you're saying? No, he doesn't. Sure. Yeah. He doesn't. I would say so. Nope. <laughs> I disagree. I mean, there's a few I, I think don't really I, have like receptors for. No, but Z got you feeling emotions. Get it out. Ah, this one, that's a very nice cover, actually. That show is coming back. <laughs> I'm not the same thing, but I thought nobody would think about that. All right. Well, that's this board game. But look, at, the game looks cool, too. You're putting these flowers in pots, making them grow taller. Is there any game that didn't get slightly squashed? Jeez. Yeah, there's been some. There's oh. been some. Uh, oh, this looks good. I think both of these are good. <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> they're really. The, they're the expansions. Yeah, Ninja Squad is good, too. This looks really cute. Tom, yeah, this looks good. No, I like oh, it. There's, like there's the a little, little bit of Rebels does Get really good games. <laughs> Rebel always does good games, and this does well, look good. I was thinking of that. And it's about flowers. Flower uh, games are good. Galaxy. Galaxy. The Intergalactic Galaxy. card game. This looks... Look at the unpack and play. Well, I hope. Well, like every game, yes. <laughs> what well, game is not? I want to see the one game that gets advertised like, you don't have to open the box to play this. Yeah, but what? the cards... The artwork looks pretty cool. I have not heard about this. Does it this. really say unpack and play on the cover? The intergalactic card game. All right, yes. All right, this one looks cool. Pocket Dungeon Quest. Wait, wait. From Brave Games. Good. Stop. Go back. No need to read instructions. Unpack and play. No need to read instructions. Oh, that's what, okay. No, but that's what they mean then. They mean that you can play it right out of the box. Yes. That sounds interesting. You like that artwork? Uh, nope. Breaking Games has really grown on mm -hmm. me. No. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, that looks like just All right, like this grid. is Jalan Jalan, a party game. Who's the bossy friend that always has the absolute say where to go? Mama says no to the planned trip you have coming up. <laughs> Sounds all too familiar. <laughs> Are you just saying random sentences? I'm confused. Play Jalan Jalan and find out where you'll be heading next. It could be a quick trip around... It could be a quick, quick, quick... Quick trip. Quick trip around town. Or an adventure of your life. Okay. What else? Well, I was going to go on a trip, but Mama said no. <laughs> Mama said there's no be no trip. Mama Don't said not no you trip. out. Mama said. All right, so here's the expansion for the networks, executives. I have not have played we this yet. This no, we have not. You just saw really? the little car pack that said executives. No, but, this but is I the feel like the expansion. executives has been out for a while. It has, but we have not gotten the expansion. There, for there's it, like a ton now. of expansions of the networks that all came together. Gil Hova gave here's me a pile. Shadow Fist, the dynamic card game. Wait, really? Shadow Cal Fist, the old the uh, original uh, Shadow CCG? Fist. This has 2012 on the box. 
Oh. Isn't that and what it, that card game yeah, is called? Yeah, but it looks like it. Look at those cards. That looks just like the CCG. Well, maybe or, this uh, is CCG. a new version of it. So this is basically maybe like a packaged box of a bunch of the CCG cards. Could be. Wow. Well, here's a nice looking game it. from Tasty Minstrel, Ghosts of the Moor. Although, I love Tasty Minstrel games a lot, but their little games always are kind of so-so. Yeah, the but last one I reviewed, ghosts. I was really unimpressed by. Ooh. Rooster Rush. By There's it. no back on this either, unfortunately. Antoine Bowser. Rooster Rush? This is from May Day. Why did the chicken cross the road? To get to the other side? Truth be told, we don't really know, but there must be something really good on the other side for the industrious rooster to brave the busy streets to get to the other side. Antoine Bowza. Boza. Rooster Rush. Rooster Rush. All right, this one I think looks good. Yeah, no. It's from Ankama. Tales of Glory. That looks cool. Did we not have a copy of this already? I don't think so. No? Why do I guess I just feel like I've seen some of these before? But that looks cool, all that stuff in the back. I like how mm -hmm. that looks. This is a, a, a good looking game. This company actually. Well, their stuff always looks good. Really looks I don't good. always like all their games, but their games always look good. Yeah, they really do. This one who made that marble game, Stellium. Yes, yeah, Stellium yes. was really good. I think so, yeah. Yeah, it was really good. I thought it was And I made the little, the little two player tile laying game called Brothers You Played With Me. Yes. They just look well, good. Well, they're the most well known always... for Crossmaster. Yeah. Uh, okay. Didn't they also do um, some um, arena combat game? Can't remember. Well, there's that boof ball thing over there. Boof ball? Boof ball, that big giant two player box. Oh, yes. I don't know that one. Here's a game of Zen and Blossoms called Trellis. I'm all about this the box. There's a lot cool. of flower games. I'm okay with that. But look, Flowers are awesome. That's a real pretty one. That looks good. Flowers are awesome. I know that's just a 3D rendering, but that looks good. The yeah, Blossoms like game looks. and this oh, game. Oh, it's another about Breaking Games. Both yeah. the Blossoms game and this game about Blossoms look good. It's the year of the flower I'm calling it now. Moving on. I have to say, with all these games, we could hold a cool stuff ding and dent sale. Wait, can I, can I say something about this? How are these even getting dinged? I, I think we need to bring like, a big bag of peanuts next time. They just like, for like, like real to keep peanuts? the energy so up, we you mean? <laughs> Okay, this game was. Proteins, this game, I love Let's Stefan go. Feld, but this one was terrible. You did not like it? No, put it in there, see it. This okay. one was terrible. I love Stefan Feld, Which I did part not, did like you not this. like Okay, I'm going to flip it over. You point at the, the thing. The randomness. You didn't like. The randomness. Did you and not like that bit there? Tom didn't like that bit. I thought that bit was oh, okay. Did you, what did you think about that right there? Hang on, Jason just said good things whoa, about this one. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, whoa. my goodness. Okay, this is, this is the one I was looking forward to. I feel like to. I'm on an air hockey table here. Okay, Look this is the game I was most looking forward to. I knew wow. it was in here. This is the new Spielberg's game, Captains of the Gulf. Oh, I don't... Look oh, at this hard work, man. It's this cool, is the man. game. Have you played this one yet? No, I haven't. They play it in a playgroup every time. I know, but... but You're too busy playing the crappy games of me. I know, and now Captains of the Gulf is here. You go shrimp fishing in the Gulf of Mexico, and it's Spielberg, so it's the best artwork. The best games, they're just an incredible company, and I'm so excited about this one. Um, Z, it says two hours. Pretty on sure that's, that's not the best. Hey, artwork. good news. We're halfway. <laughs> Through the boxes or the Kickstarter? I'm confused. Oh, the, no, but the we're boxes. at 80. We're, not... we're almost at 80. Mm -hmm. Captains of the Cold. Not till we're there. You don't, you don't, you don't yeah, do that. that you don't say hat. that. You don't count a chicken Wait, until you kill it. Look at this awesome artwork. Just put that back in there. Look at that awesome. I love I their artwork. Okay. okay. Why you look, I like Jason's enthusiasm for this game, but I've seen it on the table and it does not look awesome. The ocean is not very interesting looking. Okay, at the, all. the map of the ocean looks. Are, look we like have talked talk about Mexico. this way too long. Because yeah, it's right. Steelworks, they rock. Right, meow, so meow, MIA. <laughs> get me excited, man. Come on. Uh, this is the Nocherius Meowfia. <laughs> Meow, 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 not words? You don't even say meow? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, man. Uh, no, I don't think well, so. Do, do your token 
sound effect. <laughs> There you, go. there you go. Bluffing billionaires. It doesn't matter if you have billions of money in your possession or not. You just need to convince the others that you do. All right. That sounds cool. Well, yeah, this is uh, another game from, I think this is from... Indonesia. Indonesia, yeah. So I haven't played any of the games from them yet. I'm going to probably have like an Indonesian game night. Just like a whole pile of them. Mm -hmm. Popcon award of the game. Ah! Here's a copy of Subatomic. That's why I didn't see it till PAX. Mm. It was in there. Sometimes, great game. You've played it and you've talked about it already? Oh, yeah, I reviewed it. I really like it. All right, man, come on. Yes. Code 77. Oh, this is a new it's version. That's a nice version. That's a it, nice yeah. version. Ooh, this is how to reprint a game. Wow. Yes. <coughs> wow, that is a really nice... It's like classy. Oh, this, is this from the Korean company? It's the company yes. that does these classy looking games. They're the ones who made the really nice version dice. of Modern Art. Yes. Yes, Dice Tree. No, did the horse no, the nice one. modern art was Oink. Oink did the nice modern art. No, 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 they did uh, one too. Oink? Did you see Oink's modern they, they, art? That same year, they came out with the smallest version that's ever been out and the biggest version. Oink did one and they did one. This was great. Oink's was small. And it sucks. No, it was awesome. I mean, like, really small. You carried it around in a ring. <laughs> Stop your nonsense. <laughs> anyway, if you haven't played Code 77, it's a great deduction game. It, it is. is. That's a classic. Orbital. This is another one from DMZ, and another one that doesn't bother showing me anything of the game on the back. Okay. Why do companies do that? They're still trying to escape North Korea. They're just trying or orbitally <laughs> and come back down. The thing is, if I go, if I'm going to store and I'm going to buy a game, there's no way I'm buying a game without seeing a picture of it. That's true. I agree. Unless, um, unless you already know it's good. Yeah, right. But sure, but I saw the picture probably somewhere else. Right. I, I buy games without seeing the picture. You buy, you buy everything. Games anyway, though. You just buy games. So this is not how many, Luxor. How many, how many times do you buy games? This is Expedition Luxor. A lot. And they're wow. a standalone game. Expansion included. <laughs> okay. Wait, what? It's Rudiger Dorn. It's Rudiger Dorn. Like Apparently, Luxor is now a world. It's like and you, Planet Luxor. So and this is a standalone game that includes an expansion for itself. Yes. yes. One expansion included. That is super confusing. It's a yes. tile laying game. You know what this looks like? A reprint of Robber Knights from Rudiger Dorn. Maybe it is. There's a lot of redoing and reprinting, but how would anyone know? That's the thing. I was talking about this the other day with you where they like reprint all these games not that long after. You don't have a way to know it's the same game. So if you've been in the hobby for a while, you could very easily end up buying the same thing multiple times. Like when you buy an old movie and there's like a new version, the title isn't suddenly different. You know what I mean? It is sometimes. Yeah, but it no, is. no, no, like the cover might be different. And you're like, oh, do I have this movie? But the title of the film will no, be the same. No, I'm saying occasionally, I'm, I, I don't have a good example, but I know that Dave, I'm like, oh, it's the same movie as this movie. It ain't. They yeah, the title. Ghostbusters. You gotta stop Will buying Walk in the Chocolate Factory and Charlie in the Chocolate Factory. Those are different <laughs> movies. <laughs> They're reprints of the same movie, essentially. There we go. All right. All right. This is a roll and write game, right? Flower Valley. It's a roll and write game. Is this game? one you want? I have the other one that's like a prototype. So take I'm just, it. I'm just switching up. It's a roll up. and write. Yeah, it's a roll and write. Let me see it. You roll. You write. You are. That does oh, look wait, good. Wait, that's a mechanic. That's not a guy. <laughs> <laughs> It's a That'd Roland. Be hilarious. <laughs> it's like a year into the hobby. <laughs> of his Jason Wood. <laughs> Wait, a fidget spinner? <laughs> this game is called Master of Respect. And it looks like a lineup of villains from a Disney cartoon. <laughs> you respect my authority. <laughs> it's from Hobby Japan. Has a shield. I don't know if it's a one versus all style game. Well, many three no, to everyone five. Has their, no, everyone has a shield. Never mind. Yeah. Master looks of cool. respect. I like the I like the cover. Jason got this game solely because it was Popeye. Yes. Don't lie. I saw you do it. it Ooh, Popeye. It also, also, I walked by his booth six times, hoping he'd offer it to me because I really wanted Popeye. And and wait, it what comes is? like the whole game is made on beer coasters. Like no, but it, this is here's the thing. He made this Why game. Why do they have to be beer coasters? Why can't they just be coasters? Here's the thing though. This this game. What's German? I don't dude? know because they were German. beer coasters. <laughs> he like said, I made all my games out of beer coasters. No, he made. Probably 15 different versions of the same really? game. Yeah. No, they're all different. You're going to see is as this, we pull uh, them out. You got them all? <laughs> is this public domain? Popeye? 
It's I would close. imagine it has to be. Might not be. 1923 was Bubba out that early? Yeah. I don't know, but I'll pay you Wednesday for a hamburger for today. All right. Traveling across I'm Europe. I'm going to look it up. Traveling across Europe. Wait, that does sound the, cool. The, the, no. This is Mind I'm Fitness. Look it up. Prepare for a one of a kind travel experience without leaving the kitchen table. Sit on your fat you butt only, and go around the world. You can only play in the kitchen. Mind Fitness does good games. This looks good. This looks good. Here's Trap Words, but I've already played it and I think I'm about to review it actually. 1929. Almost. Ooh, when that one Popeye goes public domain, there's gonna be a lot of games out. Yeah, Simon's yeah, yeah. gonna make a miniature based fighting game about Popeye. And Brutus. Magnia. Remember that magnet game I had showed you where you slid them back and like there was this magnetic thing and then you pull it back and the oh, magnet you let it go it out. and it shoots it out. This That's is a pretty two cool. this is a two player set for that game. Oh really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that's, that's cool. a cool way to do flicking in games, right? Oh, I was. This is super fun. Where you don't actually have to do it, you just let the, you know, removing your finger do it. Addictive power play. So, who's the Eye Sky did, fan? I did get some expansions. I didn't like it uh, very much. I liked it. I, I liked thought it, it more was, than I did, I think. I thought it was okay. Just every time I, I, I play it, I'm thinking I like Tarkus Is this standalone? No, this is expansion. expansion number two. Where you been, man? And see, Lookout did give us some expansions. Sorry, it wasn't Earth. Caverna. That guy is a... That's a he's dangerous... Evil. That's he's a, definitely <laughs> the evil druid. No, that's Merlin, dude. No, he's evil, man. He's an evil druid. Age of Civilization. Uh, that sounds cool. Uh, yeah, it looks fantastic. <laughs> There's nothing on the back of the box. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Of Even that shade of gray is ugly. I mean, you know, I saw a video the other day about this. Sam needs to look at this it. crazy inventor from China oh, you know. who invents yeah. stupid stuff. Mm -hmm. And one of the things he invented was like the thing to make your flicking stronger is like this metal thing you put on your. And it was showing him flicking an egg and smashing it. And it was like stupid. But I was thinking that could come in handy in board flicking games. Flicking an egg? Well, I think he was just. Was showing. it like wearing something that would then. Yeah. He <laughs> invented that? <laughs> yes. Atlantis, Island of Gods. This looks like a Sam game, actually. Red Imp, is this? Red Imp? No. I don't know how, oh, why. It. it just looks like your style. That's all you, man. Red looks Imp good. did that Mars game. That's all you. Looks good. Look at like that, man. Ooh. And, and America. <laughs> I'm going to do some in a row here because they're a bunch of small games. Pajaracos. The Game Changers. Pajarajos. Pajarajos. You got to say it right. Come on. You can do it. No, I can't. Just say them all. Pajarajos. 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 You work at a Spanish TV station. Pajarajos. Come on, you say it. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, so here, we still look at the three. This one here. 11 ways to spice up your board and card games. Cow. This is from Quinted Games. This is oh, not a standalone game. Yes, that was the Quinn But thing. it works with any other board and card game. Oh, I heard about that. Have yeah. you ever wanted to cheat at your favorite game? Yes. Maybe yes. place bets, team up with other players, or sabotage another player. <laughs> yeah. This lets you do it. So basically, this is the game shark of board games. It lets you cheat at board games. <laughs> right? Like, you plug this in first, <laughs> then the board game, and you can cheat. Well... No, you actually Jason change. doesn't know what a game shark is. You actually change. I, I do know what a game shark is. That's how Jason... I played games back in the 80s. I know what a game shark Chocobo's is. Chocobo's Dungeon Monsters. This is from that company that made that Chocobo game. Fantasy it? Flight. I mean, uh, Final Fantasy. No, oh, Chocobo's Crystal Hunt. Hunt. Remember that? Yeah. Final Fantasy, which is You like the Enix. one game from them that was good, uh, like a caveman game and I like got arena or something. Really? Uh, yeah. Oh, 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 the Dice Age one. Yeah. But Chocobo, the first time I played it, I gave, I almost gave it a one. Well, this mm. is from Square Enix. No, uh, no, Did, but... Well, I mean, sure, technically. What else you got? Here you go, you. Uh, oh, Sierra yeah, that's Madre. a good one. You know I don't like Sierra Madre games. Oh, no, wait. He was saying, here you go, you Neanderthal. That's what he was saying. And then you passed Sierra it to Madre me. Sierra Madre makes really so cool things. games. Okay, these are both fairly heavy games, actually, for how small the boxes are. They are. Greenland and Neanderthal from Sierra Madre. Unemployed in Greenland? All right, so anyway. Come on, what's that from? The Sierra Madre makes really good That's games. Yeah. Moria. This is from DLP. DLP. Best known for Orleans and also known for, well, Orleans. Ataplano. 
Well, yeah, that's true. Alta Plano. Ooh, I like the, the... That looks like that was done by the guy who did the uh, Port Royal yes, the design, yes, anyway. Yeah, the, the style. How come you're not, like, tearing apart their logo? That's Which bad. one? That's a bad logo. Yeah. I mean, oh, DLP? Yes. Oh, I don't like their logo. That's a rough I don't know what it stands logo. for. I just think when I see this game, Means because they underlined the first part, it doesn't look like Moria. It looks like Moo-ria. Moo-ria. That's, Maybe it is. I mean. It's like when cows have diarrhea. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Muria. <laughs> the wow. worst thing known to mankind. Wow. Muria. <laughs> Wait, heard my, hands my hands are off. My hands are off. Now we have Muria. Muria. My, my the, hands the are off. The table is lava. Coconuts edition. Ah! Coconuts edition. <laughs> the meeples are all wearing coconut bras. Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm done with the hat. They are. For the day. I know they are, but I'm still saying, oh my goodness. Was well, better as a way of the coconuts than not. All right, I like this theme, even if it's not a good game. That is it a jumping a formation? So this is literally is balls in here. Is that pronounced kinke? I don't know what that word is. Or is it pronounced quink? Quinky. The five That's man formation. That's not right. I know that. I don't know what well, is right. Five man formation is probably quinque. Quince. Quin. Oh, we passed eighty thousand. Thank you, everybody. Quinke. Quink. It could be chinke. Ch ch yeah, but it's not. F it's five man. Five. five. Yeah, chinke. chinke, chinko, chinke. It could be okay. chinke. Chinke. This one I'm interested in because Strawberry Studios has a good rep right now. They, they do. do. That's a good Scare it. Oh, you played this one. I already played this one. Oh, I reviewed it as well. Scare it. Oh, you reviewed it? Yeah. Man, was it good? Oh, we'll get it out of here then. Did you like it? Yeah, it was good. It's good. It's good for. It's good. Uh, kid game. Yeah. It's uh, basically like a paper, rock, scissors. Oh, this kind of animal this. Gift scares party. this kind of animal. You have Fiesta to, de uh, regalos. Hey, that was pretty good, Chase. I'm practicing. Uh, Toda esa montaña de regalos es para nosotros. Venga, los vamos abriendo y, mi y mientras jugamos. See, now you're just showing off. I know what you said, though. You said, look at all those presents. <laughs> are, you still, are you sure those are all for us, Joe? <laughs> the best thing is that we can play while we're opening them. Let's go. Except for the let's go, but yeah, they didn't say that. Bitcoin <laughs> hackers this is the theme of Vamos. that. Vamonos! Vamonos! <laughs> Yeah, uh, all right. Whatever. Moving on. True. Bitcoin this hackers. one I'm pumped about because I like the the look of it. The counterfeiters. Uh, this this makes me think of you the like the look of how it looks like a book. Oh, smack! It is no, a book. No, I like the animal art on it. Oh. But it's a book with animal art. No, it's not. It look is. at the other side. It's a book. Oh, I didn't see it's the other a side. book. It is. They got you, son. Yeah. I didn't see the other side. They got right. you, son. <laughs> Open your mouth and your This foot. looks like the reprint of the Louis the Fifteenth or Fourteenth or whatever. What was that game called? The reprint, Mafiozu. Yeah. It looks like it's in the that. same universe. Is yeah. this? No. no. I just no, made I'm that up. Just, this is Quind. This is in the the, the Isn't it Zoom Quinid? cinematic universe. Or Quinid? It's Quinid, I believe. Yes. Artworks by Ian O'Toole. He's a good he's artist. All over the place. Yeah. Oh yeah, he's he and Vincent Detroit are like having a contest who can draw the most art in the course of a year. Who is Pecunia Olay? Is that the designer? I don't think so, right? No, it says game design, but, but so Pecunia Olay Counterfeiters? What does that mean? Wait, isn't Pecunia Non Olay that game you like? Yes, it is. That's why I'm wondering. Is this a reprint of that? No. How do you know? Checking. No. How do you know those animals aren't pooping? That's probably, that could Wait, be. Wait, is this the pooping game? Wait a minute. Game? No. Is this the pooping game? Is it? Is it the pooping game? Wait. No, I love the, the pooping, pooping game. game. I'm about to defecate myself if you give me a fire. <laughs> do Wait, it. Who's the designers? Olivier Bourgeois. <laughs> that was a first pretty close. magnificent <laughs> close. <laughs> I'm sorry. No, it's not the same game, then. All right. Cause that, yeah, okay, look this up. It says Pecunia Ole. Oh, no, but I know it what it is. It says Pecunia money. Non Ole. Yeah, Pecunia Non Ole means money doesn't stink. Pecunia Ole means money stinks, then. Yes. Maybe that's just the title in German. Uh, we all got a little too excited for something stupid there. <laughs> I am. I mean, I'm on the. Do it. I feel like we. This need to game is line set up. in Miami, Florida. By the way, is it really? I know. That's I I've seen those guys in my neighborhood. <laughs> that crowd goes I, to my I, gym. I've seen the alligators before. Is it really set in Miami? Penny, I'm gonna need to get a. It doesn't say on the box. Uh, hey, Sam, can you pass the uh, power cord up here underneath? It's right behind you. Oh yeah, I've I've seen the alligators. I don't see it. I don't see it. Kenny will do it. 
All right, what else are we, are we looking at here? Oh, All right. right there. Witless wizards. This is a great... How can, be a, how can a wizard be witless? Well, he's not very smart. But yeah. he's a wizard. So he's almost... He almost has to be smart, right? And the sequel, Dumb Druids. Dumb... <laughs> That's the expansion. Witless wizards, dumb druids. It's <laughs> pretty good jokes, man. Jason is... What happened? Hundred percent. This has I been sitting sleep. on our shelf forever, hasn't it? I don't remember. What? That. I don't remember that. I don't remember that. Well, then it's yours. Here we go. You have to, you have to read it while it's coming. Well, oh, oh, it's <laughs> coming. It came back. Kwan. 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 Horrible box. <laughs> Kwanza. Here's Verona Twist. Oh, this I was excited about. Sister I think. of Oliver. Let me look. Yes, this was. This was. Is this a Romeo and Juliet? Kind of thing. Oh, that does look good. I Six saw one own Veronese. Oh, Verona's not. Why is city. she holding a mask of an old dude? She's pretending to be an old dude. Mind Fitness has some really <laughs> cool things. Why do I have to ask these questions, Samuel? Just pointing things out, Holmes. Yeah, that one looked good. It looked like an interesting, okay, uh, well produced. Well, there's another one you're gonna like. Cortino. Look, abstract is it strategy. Cortino or Cortino? Cortino. Cortino. That looks pretty good. Abstract strategy. Why is Sierra Madre making all their games in such small boxes, Quartino though? I don't know. Pax, mm -hmm. Emancipation. Have you played this one? For that. I haven't yet. <laughs> this is the new one. Oh, this is the one I just... This is, uh, well, the, the other ones one. are older games. This the one's the one's new older. one. This is the new one. All right, I'll give it a whirl at some point, I'm sure. Those are supposed to be extremely heady games from they what are. I understand. Yeah. Well, John Company, I really liked it. Did you like John Company? Yeah, but it was so long. What John is Lenta to do? You play TI4. You don't see me playing it all yeah, the time. Yeah, but there's a... What is this little meat? thing? It's a cool looking game. It's a honey badger, man. You don't care, man. I what I think care. of is... This looks, this looks awesome. The pa Pax Emancipation. This one. What is that? Voter uh, kill. The root Black Skull Prime. Island. Now, this is a larger game from Strawberry Studios than everything they've put out before. That is true. I haven't seen that one. I, I didn't even realize it was Strawberry Studios. I just assumed yeah. their games all were in little card boxes. Right, right, right. But this is a new thing. Black Skull Island. The artwork has all the other games they've put out. is fantastic. Yep. And this, I assume, then, is not just going to be a card game. What do we got here? Or is it? Pirates. Is that like a mystery? Pirates. Pirates this looks and good, mermaids. Man. Oh this my! Looks, this looks really good, Sam. You'll probably enjoy that. Speaking of looking good, this one looks good. This one players. looks really good. This has been getting some serious buzz, I think, right? A pleasant yes. journey to Nico. Wow, I like how this one looks a lot. The, I mean, uh, the bat, that just looks neat. It does. He, he was the one who was wearing the sailor hat the whole time. Mmm. I'm trying to remember now. It was the the only Korean guy, or I think Korean, who was wearing a sailor's cap the whole time at Essen. Mm. All right, and then contract. It's kind or of Taiwanese, ugly. as Kenny I'm not said. Really, I'm not really a big fan of this box. This I like does that look cover good. way Do better you? than a Pleasant Trip to whatever that was. That's because Pleasant Trip is a Euro oh, game. I'm sorry, you don't like no one Euros. died in that game. I'm just saying, if it's not dark and evil looking, what's the point of playing it? Yeah, if it's playing Everything it. has a price. It's just a matter of what you're willing to pay. In contract, this will be your motto. Unless you're Z, in which case it's your motto outside the game. Mm -hmm. Stabby, stabby, make that cash. <laughs> which is also wow. the new live rap album coming out soon. We're getting there, folks. Stabby, We're getting stabby. there. How many we got left? Stabby, stabby, make that cash. Uh, um, how we doing? How many, how many boxes that, we got left? I really hope no one has Six. to use that restroom. <laughs> or any restroom. Right All right. Oh, this is a really pretty game. The cover, at least. Wow. Oh, wow. do you know why? Because it's about flowers again. Horticulture. That is definitely the thing. Master. That is the new thing. Wait, how many? How many fire games came out of Essen? Yeah. It's, I think five. We've had maybe four. This I mean, is that really here. a very pretty cover. It is horticulture master. All right, this game, 1347. The Black Pest... What does it uh, say? The Negro Pestis Ludo, the game, of, the game of the Black Plague. The Black Plague. Anno Domine, 1347. No one is safe from the plague. 
Flag. That's kind of a cool looking okay. board there. Look at that. I it's like, totally like passed me by there. I never saw this game. Jason finds everything. Uh, all I have to say is I really like the uh, this those fan the masks. Do you remember when we did like Universal look, Halloween yeah. Horror like, and they had we went into the the dude. catacombs and they had those guys with these masks and it freaked us out. Okay, just to be clear, I don't know what everywhere you're I went, about. Hollywood Horror freaked me out. Even yes. like the guy when I walked in and he just took my ticket, I was like, "What?" <laughs> It's like the show hasn't started yet, kid. Wow, this looks really, really good. But it's basic. Yeah. It is the basic version. What's that about? I don't know what that means. Oh, new Love version. New is version. that a reprint? Yes. It is, but it's a much nicer version. Oh, interesting. That was like from one it's year to the next, edition, right? second yeah. Yeah. Well, they also sent me... Actually, I just got a pack. I've been sitting at my desk for a while. Of, they Something was wrong with the card, so they reprinted them and sent them to me. Got it. Very I like nice Christmas reprint. Tree. Yeah, it's I have to say, it's not very. Um, I don't know. It's a little dark. The original like the box cover isn't cover. particularly bright. The original box cover was a little nicer. I like that cover a lot. Ugly. Well, it's got a giant Christmas tree on it that looks awesome. But def definitely, you can tell it's a quality reprint. That's another cool cover. I like that cover. Okay, now we're getting to the good Zar. stuff. Zar. You know, we didn't pack it like in any specific order. No, I know. But I'm assuming you put the cool games in this box. <laughs> um, I will. I will smash that. Mm -hmm. That assumption soon. I'm about to break that. Here, here, here comes something bad. This looks neat. Zor does look neat. I don't know how to say this one at all. This is one is from says. Indonesia again, I it's believe. It's coup. It's coup something. Oh, is this their coup? Oh, yeah, just I'm coup. Good. I'm sorry. Oh, that's neat. What does it's it say then? Oh, on the very whoa. top. Coup. How is it that every single version of Coup looks better than Coup? Like every single one. I don't know. True. True, true, yeah. true. My goodness, feel that. Zaga Zagaznik. Is it heavy? Cosmo. Well, for what Tom's looks just tired. It doesn't look like it's that in the box. Wow, uh, I was excited about this. I saw the back of the box. That green is oppressive. <laughs> oppressive. <laughs> Get it out. It really Wait, is. That it's actually, it's, stop. It's, it's weird. It's actually Cosmo not green. Games. It's like a yellow and it looks green. It looked green on the screen. This is yeah, a smartphone like, company. Ugh. It yeah, could be good. That game's not doing any favors. Whoa. Sorry. What do you want me to say? I like the squirrel and the I'm going to give it a chance side, because but... they did Smartphone Inc., which is incredible. All right. I won't argue that. Z's already reviewed this, I believe. <laughs> the so. creepy seller. Ooh, if you've already reviewed it, that means I can have it. I got this Rice cool. dice. Spirits of the dice patty. I've heard nothing it's about this game, stuff. have you? You'll like it. I didn't even know they made Rice Dice. Now you played Spirits Dice Patty, I yes. think. I played it. It's a decent game, but a dice, dice game version, always makes me happy. Yeah, it's, like, it's a different thing. I mean, it's a, it's rice not dice. an expansion. Are the, right? are the dice actually made of rice? Yeah. Uh, yes. yes, of course. You can eat them if you want. This game's called Streaming. It's too it's close little, to the real to real life. Like, your channel like needs that was a, you know, that was <laughs> content <laughs> to attract new subscribers. Compete with rival media channels to get the best content, but remember to take into account what the audience wants to watch. Oh, this too is real. cool. This is too really real. cool. Work the board. I can't game. do this. Run a Kickstarter. <laughs> Run a Kickstarter? It's yes. too real. No, I can't. Work the board game. Work the board game. <laughs> oh, this game looks creepy as all get out. Tokyo, Tokyo Ghoul. Ghoul. Bloody what? No, Masquerade. that's great. Tokyo Ghoul is, is an anime. Yeah. Maybe. That's fine. It it's doesn't make it less creepy. It's creepy. Look at that guy. Mm, do you get to murder people? Look at the side of the box there. Mm. I think that looks cool. It's a cool ghoul. Hmm. Mm -mm -mm. I know, it's rough. <laughs> Let me see. Ghouls are on the move. Haven't I been sitting on another game that's like 1926? Yes, there's a bunch of them. There's like four in so that series. So now there's 1906? Yes, and that one's supposed to be really good. 1906. Well, that's, 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 how slow you're, that's how slow you're reviewing these, these dated games. I'm sorry, man. Going We're going backwards. back in time. <laughs> Go figure. Yeah. It's for kids. That's Go also Smartphone Inc.'s company. <laughs> softball yeah, for softball you. Softball is that good. There's another pretty cover. Oh, Pandora. Oh, that, that looks cool. Gorgeous. Yeah, it is. Oh, the game itself also doesn't look bad. Although that elf needs a haircut badly. Oh, man. It's supposed to look like that. 
Oh, oh he needs Jeff. a comb. It's by Jeff Ollers. Jeff Ollers, Ooh. yeah, one of the cool designers. Yeah. Pandora, it, it looks good. cool. Well, Burns Einstein, that's his company, I think. Yes, games. it is. It is. I like some of his games. Ooh. Well, here you I'm go. In that's that artwork for it. You want it? Name. That's for a different game, I guess. But artwork. Boss. This Just does artwork. look good. Jason, this is, looks like it goes with it. It Ooh, does, that and that's artwork that goes with it. All right, now we have Nematon. Nematon. Blam! Ooh, I reviewed that. I have to use the light on that one. You did? Yes. Was it good? Yeah. Did you have that little piece on it? I don't know. I think your review is invalid without that piece. Oh, now that is creepy. Oh. Wait, is that? A, oh, that's an art book. Oh, yeah, uh, jump scare. Yeah, I don't remember. That's, oh, man. oh, you missed it. You missed it. Ah! That's really terrifying. That's a really, really scary, that's not scary your image. Juice. Um, I think it's the same thing. Yeah, I mean, I reviewed this. <laughs> no, 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 no. As Bring far it back. as this, as far as this no, I sir. Know. Oh, what is wrong with you? Yeah. Sam, this you better so not it. say anything good about is that. Is this the one that you are interested in, or Sam? You're both. Sam, I am interested in that one. But it's, it's about Robin Hood, though. Straight to my stack. All right. Is this how we're doing it? Okay. Oh, and now for heavy. next That's year's Spiel is Yours winner, possibly the best game of the I fair. I agree with that. This is <laughs> the best. Uh, Kaka alarm. <laughs> I, I worked so hard to get this one. You this have is to the toilet, toilet, poop toilet game. and then catch a caca in your hand. Catch a caca in your hand. When the caca shoots up, you have to catch it in your hand. Caca alarm. Oh, oh just... that little child, he will never wash his hands. Caca alarm. Caca alarm. No, but okay, I've seen commercials on TV for this. Yes. Like, did no one stop and say, this seems like. We've no, gone below. Toilet. <laughs> this kid, this is like, I worked hard to get a copy of this for us. I know you did. I'm just I saying. Have to, I have to do this. I have to. Here, I can show Come you how on. it works because I've already played it. No, I think we need batteries. Sorry. Oh, no, you don't. You don't. It comes with a plunger. Caca alarm. I have to do this. This yeah, is the first this. true <laughs> unboxing. Here, give me it all. I'm gonna, I know how to make this. I know how to make the caca come Does out. Does it need batteries? <laughs> you know. <laughs> you know. Did you did you process that statement before you said it? Because I don't think you did. I think everybody knows how to make give the caca come out. Give me. Give, give it it's natural. It just happens. Give me the toilet. Give me the toilet right now. Oh, what is happening? Give me the toilet! <laughs> Give me the toilet! Calm <laughs> down, Jason. Here. Caca right. alarm! Here, show okay. me a close up, please. So, here we go. Hang on. Hey, We're opening the toilet. Over here. Wait, wait. Let's get the. This is. This was my most sought after. Right, so this is it a took plunger, me four okay. days to get this lesson. That's a plunger. There wait, you hang go. Hang on. Now, this is fecal matter. Caca alarm! Wait, wait. Here. Put the caca oh. in the toilet. Sunny, sunny side up. It's Mr. Hanky. <laughs> if you hide the smile, it's, it's disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> Let me see the smile. Put him in here. Wait, wait. It kind of does let's, look let's like a, a, a candy here. bar if you're like holding it the right. Baby Ruth, yeah. baby Ruth. Yeah, yeah. So exactly. he goes. Right, wait, wait, let his in? smile. Come on, let his smile go in there. Close it up. Now you roll the dice Come by the on. flusher, and then you flush the dice out. Okay, that's awesome. Two. And you got a two. You got plunge a it twice. Plunge, plunge that two. baby twice. All right, my turn. Oh, no. yeah, yeah, Wait. Yeah. Stop, stop, stop. Hey, Z. hey, hey. Z. Sam's turn. Actually, we got go, clockwise. Go. All right, here we go. Is the caca going to jump out? That. Flush it. Flush One. it. Oh, no. Oh, Someone I said we need made. this on a t-shirt. Flush <laughs> it. Three. Three. <laughs> go, three. You have to go number three. Oh, oh, yes! I caught it! I caught the caca! Caca alarm! Put it away! I'm keeping no. it in my <laughs> uh, this, was, this was the best find it as in caca alarm. Caca alarm! Where's the box? Where's we the box? We evolved as a species. Grab me I'm the box. sorry. No, Grab me the box. Man, nah. Oh, Caca it's actually alarm. squishy too. Caca alarm. Oh, come on. They could have put like a little fart noise maker All on All right, let's go. <laughs> Next game. It's horrible. When I'm Caca the voice alarm. of reason, it's problematic. No, it's, I agree. I'm going to leave this in the counter. Someone's going to get a surprise when they go to eat lunch. Um, 
stop talking. Seriously, you were ahead. Okay, here, caca alarm. Someone's got to catch this because so I don't want to break it. That is my question. <laughs> Can we move that? I hope the review isn't crap. It's a Miami Dice. It's a Miami Dice. We, we all we could do, do that. It. No, we're not doing this again because I was there the last time you guys played that poop game and he went on for what, an hour on these poop jokes? Yeah. Yeah. All right, what do we got? Poop jokes are golden, man. I don't know why you shy away from them. I'm just I saying. know. None of them are stinkers. Poop and fart jokes are all... No, Hasp. they're all stinkers. H-A-S-P. Hasp. It's we're, like, we're back to oh, serious. It's that. a trick-taking game. Played in teams. You need to predict the outcome of the round. Mm, I don't like the ones where you predict how many tricks really? you're going to take. Oh, that's you're oh those either. are good games. What did you, you like, say? Didn't you like that? Uh, sorry, I don't know why I said it. The, the, the Roman you like Senator that one. one. that was the, um, from Mind Fitness Games? Which one? The, um... It starts with an S. Yeah, Spear... Spearian or something like that. Yes, something like that. All right, UFO, unnamed, <laughs> farmed, organite, organite, organ organiz organism. S. What company? Mind Fitness. Came in a little white box. Sponsor. This is a party Sponsor. game Sponsor. of yeah. speed and memory. Nope. Speed and memory? Unnamed farm organisms. This one is one I'm interested in for sure. Dicium? It's Dicium Civilization. Now, the, what this game does is there's four different games in here that use the same board, which I'm, you know, always a little eh about, but the dice are the same, so... <clears throat> so it's actually a different board with the same dice. I'm sorry, yeah, I'm sorry. It's four different boards with the same die, yes. Each one more boring than the last. <laughs> well, at least they dropped out 500 of them. <laughs> is that not a poop joke? It might be good. Cover looks more interesting than the lettering on the side, actually. Factory Ooh. funner and bigger. Oh, 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 it's fun around bigger. Lies. Oh. oh I have my own copy! <laughs> Nomopolis. This is a gnome mm -hmm. building game. Mm -hmm. uh, my baby now. Oh my goodness. You are trying to grow gnomes mm -hmm. in the city. Kaka Allah. <laughs> fun around bigger. <laughs> That this one I got for you to see. This box something. feels oh, very, no. very light for. Did what's we just in it. see this? No, my, it's, no I know it everything was, started to blur together. It was a gnome thing. <laughs> yeah, I, this was also one of the ones that I was looking at for my um, most uh, anticipated as well. Wait, Top okay. 10 gnome games. I know. Yeah, there's two of them. I know we saw this one. Yep. <laughs> we're getting to that part where we're seeing <laughs> things twice. Okay. okay, how did we end up with two of these? I swear I didn't pick up two Something of these. Something is missing. Something is missing. Okay. You know what, though? Okay, that's kind of a... <clears throat> if you asked me how to play that guessing from the back, I would have no idea. Right. So what's missing is the rules. That'd be hilarious. Like, <laughs> to get it, it's like, the rules. Ah, ah, Something ah. is missing, and then you open it up, it just says the rules. Hey, do eat. Do eat, good sir. Oh, this is like a puzzle-finding game. It looks cool. Do eat. It's a tiny game for two players. It'll okay. be learned in five minutes and played in ten. Okay. Z. It's shortest game in the world. Oh, yeah, we, right, we right, right. Wait, exactly. that was the other game. Yeah, it looks good. It kind of looks like, um, what's that rat? Brave Rats. It kind of looks like Brave Rats, which yeah, is okay. R, you know. I like yes. Brave Rats. Now that we got a copy of there, I believe. Rebel Knox, you've already reviewed we this? We played no. it. It was, I didn't like it's it. It's a weird trick-taking game. I'm, I've messed with it a little bit, but I haven't given it a proper play. Highlander the Duel. There can only be two players. <laughs> <laughs> Are your jokes making you laugh? Yeah, I'm stupid. Taiwan Formosa, and I am about do to we review this that? one. We do have this yeah, one. Yeah, okay. What is oh, it? Oh, you're about to review this? It's, it's okay. Basically, it's, it's a, a game in which you, you roll dice, and you, you get these combos of resources, essentially, to buy cards. Mm -hmm. But you look at the combo, instead of going, I wonder what card I should buy, you look at the combo and go, which card costs that amount? That one? That's the one I'm buying. Sure. That's problematic. That's triggering my cock hour. Oh. Wow. Oh, the shrink wrap didn't work, Jason. In fact, the shrink wrap probably. <laughs> didn't don't, let it escape, don't look yeah. at this one, folks. Oh, this is too bad because this one looks really Strawberry good. Studios Little Monster Studios. Strawberry Studios. Jeez, oh, what a beating. <laughs> wow, no. that one got massacred. Uh, not the only one to get massacred. Oh. Okay, that's, I that's blame customs for this. Ass. Look, look, even I'm happily this is an expansion box. That's it, the same expansion that we had a nice 
other copy of. Even I'm like getting a little unhappy with these. Wannabe football. Wannabe football. Yeah, if you're not good enough for football, you're a wannabe. A fast so so tell me what you Madden. want, what you really, really want. It's a two to four, ten minute player game. Well, whatever. That looks interesting. Really? No. I like football, and I don't think that's interesting. Okay, I was that looks Fortune cool. City. I've no, already been played this one. A lot of love. Oh, you have a copy of this already? I've I just reviewed it. Oh, okay. Did and you like it? I do not. And it's not getting a lot of love because I went and read all the other reviews to see if I was missing anything. Oh, it's not. It's just, I've just seen a lot of pictures. Some people, well, some people have said it's good. My biggest problem with this game is, again, it. first of all, player turn order is almost too big of a deal. Mm-hmm. And secondly, there's like you drive these trucks around and pick up coins and, mm-hmm. and points, and it's not as interesting. That part of the game is so low value compared to the rest. Is it a city building kind of game? Yeah, but it doesn't really matter where you put stuff. Not I much. I don't like that. City building is flat. Okay. T Dragon Society. Jeez, like the third time we get that game. Yeah. Farben. Every color tells a story. Does that stronghold? Oh game? my goodness. Farben. Is he even trying anymore? It could if you had not shown me that logo, I would have said this is from some small publisher. He didn't put his logo on the front. I'm oh, sorry. On. Wait, wait. If there's a game about color, shouldn't there be color on the cover? There is. <laughs> What is this? All right, this is a game in which you're going to associate a color with a word and the stories emerge by themselves. Remember, the color is played with the help of the narrated stories to score at the end. I played a game like this before where you tell a story and you're playing Once colors. Once upon a time. And then you have to remember the colors played and the story will help you remember them. Sure, so. So. Sounds, sounds like money. Money. Sounds like it sounds riveting. It does. My caca alarm is going off. <laughs> 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 that is a, that is an amazing crossover statement. Very well done. Mini World War II. This one I'm also very interested this in. This looks really cool. It's all you, Holmes. That looks really cool. That is yeah, definitely I you. Saw this. It does look interesting for sure. Thank you, sir. I want to see it. It looks cool. Don't give it to him. Oh, that looks cool. Tsukiji. 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 What is this company? RBX. Uh, Why is everyone yelling at the sumo wrestler? Because he ate everything. <laughs> Because they're all it looks like it. Anyway. <laughs> Sukiji. How's this looking? Yeah. Sukiji. Sukiji. Anyway, let me look at that some more. We gotta be close to done. No. Four more boxes? That looks yeah, pretty good. Like this box only has 58 games. It's like a set collection game. <laughs> Are you kidding on that? No. It says 58 games in one box. <laughs> There's snacks in there though. To all keep right. us Ooh. going. Yes. Yeah, Are there snacks? Oh. oh. Mystical we, we seeds. Can break those out. This, this is another cool one too. about growing flowers. Oh, but this one looks great. This one did look, look that. cool. That That's a really cool, cool container, yeah. All right. I'll I take, am telling you. I'll this take all like, the flower games. That box took a beating. This is well. the thing. No, some of those looked great. Oh, we're from oh. Zucker. Here's some shirts. Cool. What size are the shirts? Yeah, Warful and Zucker. This one's 3XL. That's too big for me. That's too big for this me. This one looks like my size. This one's just large. You're not. I'm the only large in the group. Wow. What is this? Oh, it. Werfel and Zucker. Three eggs. That is. I'm Whoa, liking is, it. Is yours? I you need me it? some new shirts. Werfel and Zucker. Ooh. My shirt. Another one that was a little too small. Did you buy it or no, That looks like out of Newsies. Huh? Someone gave it to me. Let me see it. It looks nice. It's very pretty. It's a really nice hat. Oh, that's a, that's a nice leather hat, dude. Sure. Well, it's oh, not this, mine. Is a, it's nice. this is. Wow. The Stetson. It's, it's yeah. probably too small. Actually, this is medium on here, I think. Yeah. No way. All right. I don't know what these are, but they look good. Put them uh, with the other My brain is shrinking. Is it only going to fit on me? <laughs> Am I the only one that this, this is going to fit on? No way it's going to fit your head. <laughs> okay, it doesn't fit me. What are these things? I don't know. <laughs> but I do feel like I jump. I like time warp back to the like 2019 to 1919. Oh, what is it? Picos Camperos? I don't know what that is. Right. Masa de pan Pamea horneada. Made at home? No, home masa made? de pan. No, horneada means uh, in an oven. Made in an Here. oven. Are we going to do an unboxing and do a review? Not yet. Nope. Not yet. Stop throwing the snacks! Invisible? I can see it. See their hat coming on? I can't oh. see it. Oh! Wait, 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 whoa! Oh, it's whoa. a lenticular cover. Is it a lentic? Oh, that's awesome. 
It's a dexterity card game. You need to find something that's missing. Yeah, never mind. But the co oh, that cover is cool. This game looks awesome. That is cool. Magma, Magma Storm. Storm. Wait, I don't remember picking up Magma Storm. That's because some of us get the good games. Ooh. No. Did they drop like it? it? No, maybe I did yeah, pick it up. How many times oh, you now you're gonna change that. it. Oh no, I know what I didn't pick up for Fireland. It wasn't Magma Storm. It was Feast for Odin expansion. I'm sorry, Tom. Hang on one moment. This is burning, right? <laughs> This is when the same people made Terra Mystica and all. Yes. Okay. And Feast for okay. Odin. So you're not interested. No. You're no. not interested. This one looks awesome. Magma Storm looks I'm phenomenal. Not. It's a cool cover. But Here's a Juggernaut awesome mini expansion looks. for City of Gears. Oh, that's cool. A Juggernaut expansion? Well, that's awesome. What we got to get that? that in our City of Gears. It's a, it's a special tile Juggernaut. Move the Juggernaut tile across any players. If any opponents, robots, or dare, choose one to destroy. <laughs> oh, and it's a little mini in here, I guess, yeah. and a tile. That's cool. This looks like a huge box for one mini and one tile. But I guess that's what it is. It's a mini expansion. Do, 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 do. It's do, time do, for 8-bit crap. Do, do, do. Here we go no, again. 16-bit crap. Oh, I'm sorry. I apologize. 16-bit. That's better. Twice as good. It's a little bit larger. It that really is a 16-bit board game. So power up. Yeah, I'm getting tired of doing that joke. I remember 16-bit. <laughs> okay, that will awesome. be good. Just I don't know what this pass. one is. Can someone explain to me, though, what's another, the, it's another I don't, poop joke. Though. Just let it pass. Wait, power up is a poop joke? Mm -hmm. I don't remember that. You Here's a two-player War of the Worlds oh. game. I believe that Gray Fox is kickstarting this as we speak. Oh, okay. Is that what that is? A War of the Worlds? Yeah, of it's the a two world? player game. Uh, really? Yeah. I like that cover. That's cool. I yeah, like you gotta cover. love this cover, man. Bad yes. Lands. Witness me! Yes, that's cool. Wow. Uh, the yeah, problem sorry. with these games is that. That looks they're cool. usually really complicated and really, really long. Good. They try to make them all simulations. Lavka, you mean? No, I mean just these post apocalyptic games. Usually this end one up says getting... 60 to 120, which might be too that's long fine. for you, no, but that's fine. it two looks hours. cool. That looks Bad really good. Uh, let me black. I love this logo, though. Yeah, it does. It looks really good. Artwork is amazing. Yeah, yeah. See, what's, that's so not my type Outpost of game. Outpost of Humanity. All right. This could be good. 2 Are to these? 4, 60 to 120. It's got a lot of things, though. Mm -hmm. Are these games compatible? Maybe. Maybe. We got In Invictus the King and Invictus Jet the Shogun. Games Studios. Uh, They're two-player tactical card games. That's it's the same uh, game? I would imagine it's the same game, which is two different themes. Oh, that's kind of cool. Oh, like which theme would you pick? I'd pick the Shogun, Shogun every time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I would pick a Shogun over a King. This is nice. These are, again, this artwork. I really like this artist. Hmm. Weberson Santiago. Hmm, this is unfortunate. This is get me a fresh brain. This is from the guys who made that evil genius thing that you guys didn't like. But man, that's not a. That, it just looks like a prototype almost. Did it get beat up? Or um, how come it's not closed? All our games are getting beat up. Yeah. I don't like this look yeah. at all. This yeah. this is get me a fresh brain. Well, that evil genius or whatever. Give me box. a fresh design. Wow. All right, here's some mean. witless wizards promo packs. Oh. The Druid deck, it doesn't say Dumb Druids, but that be, if it had been, I would have applauded you. And uh, for Sam, a Viking deck. Now we're talking. <laughs> oh, what the Sam hell, let's have horns on it. Oh, Underwater Cities promo. I got that for us. For who? For us, for the copy that's in Let's the look what's in my front pocket here. Underwater City cards, I believe they have to go together. Oh, they do. Oh, wait, you've wait, been hanging wait, out with wait. Drake too much. That's right. <laughs> Put that in the middle of the table. Everyone has to see what that is. All it's right. So it's a little green dome. Is. It's okay. No, yeah. that's a big deal. It's if you a play big the game. Deal. Come on now. Show the green this dome. This is the green dome. Green dome Where it up. I see the green dome. Whoa. This is the underwater scene. You know, it looks like that. looks like one of those poppers that you press and then it pops up in the air. Yeah, why is this a big deal? I don't get it. Because there's only red and white in the game. Now there's green. This is the green one. This is the special kelp dome. It's green. It's green. I'm actually not being facetious. <laughs> It's cool. That, that that's off. going into the into right, library cool. copy. As is these two cards pocket. that someone found and they... Oh, so those cards weren't even frozen. Those were lost cards from the cruise. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we found it in the ocean. Here's another expansion for Celestia. Did you yes. know there was another expansion? No, I didn't. What it's called it call? Little Nischim. Now you can save the aircraft by using oh. its rowboat. So you yes. get on the rowboat and get off. 
You've heard I, about this that's one? That's all yes. no, I haven't. Blam gave it to us. Hmm. No, but it's cool. Gravity Superstar. This one I got to see a demo oh, of it. Sorry, that was, I didn't mean to flip it that so hard. That kind of looks interesting, actually. It is. It's. It's. This a, looks like uh, uh, that round that. What's that robot game that you... Ricochet Robots. Ricochet Robots. Imagine Ricochet Robots meets Magic Maze. That's the... Oh, that's how shoot it me in the mouth. Yeah, I agree. It's not real time, though, so don't worry. Then shoot me in the mouth slowly. Who cares? I mean... Ugh. All yeah. right. You want it, Stan? Ricochet Robots meets Magic Maze. Bali, there's the... Hey, there's the game you were just talking about. That to review also, the other one. that is my... Uh, you remember that's the name of my HOA, my neighborhood. Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah. yeah, they're the best HOA it, ever. It's, it's the this, best. So Tom has mm -hmm. this weird thing where he doesn't just have Legit. a gate for his community; he has a second gate for Bali. That's how you do Who it. Has two gates. This is just a tablecloth. No, it's a bag. It's a, a bag. Draw bag. Is it? Is it a tile playing game? It's the roll and write game. No. Oh. It's the roll and write game. That's Here's weird. It. I don't know why there's a bag. Enter the world of Slavic oh, these demons. Guys, these guys talked to me for a while about their design. They were very excited about it. You know what? I and remember it looks these good. guys. It looks good. These guys were down in that room, right? Yeah. Yes, yeah. they were down in the, in the demo room. I don't know. Before. This game, The board looks very, like, same. -y. I saw the game set up. It did look good. And they have a lot of, you know, they're very excited about the history of the game and sort of the, the setting. Um... Yes. I don't know if it's a good game, obviously, but they were very excited about it. All right. This must be another one of those. It's all uh, in German. Say what? Wait a minute. This is a dice deck seal of approval. It must be. Oh, this is the same. Oh, game this is the reprint of. Um, what do you say? Or what's it to you? What? What's it to you? Which was a basically print and play game, and had I reviewed it now, I would have just been like, I wouldn't have, have touched it. Because right. it came like on a little envelope. Yes, you get five things and you put them in order, and with your the, the whoever your partner is, and you want to put them in the same order, and then you yell really loudly because they don't. Mm -hmm. Here's another game. I don't know what it's pronounced. Circus Puppy. Isn't this already on our shelf somewhere? Circus Puppy. Here's a box Ooh. of ramen. No. <laughs> what is that? Conversation, but this says it's got flowers on it. It says girls only. Oh boy. So is it, and Amanda, I guess we give that too. Or, uh, or we can no. just not. What is that? Conversation girls only. Why? This, this I would open it and read open one, it. but so do dumb. you want me to get in trouble? Open it. Hey man, you're a rebellion. As what should you do? My battery pack being changed. Actually. I don't know how you open that. Reminder for everyone else. You got to slip the slip case. Uh, it's a slip case. No, I don't think it is a slip case. It's actually. St it might just be. Uh, Why are you a little opening that? It's four girls only. Because I'm rebel. That's right. We rebel. That's okay. rebel. Now I'm back. Oh, they rebel. Microphone on again. Take it out. Um, on. What? All right, operators. That's kind of a smooth up. '90s cover. Oh, that actually looks pretty interesting. Okay, it is not a slipcase. It Wait, it's like not a slipcase? Yeah, just don't worry about it. It's just got a video game. It has a video game vibe to it. Yeah, what do you think? Let's see, yeah. It's not a slipcase. I was talking about this. One of the games that I unboxed has that very... It's almost like it's too clean, the artwork. It's too posed. Yeah, it's too... It's too it looks like a video game cover from the 90s, right? Where there's right. two guys in the front. Yeah, kind of. Right, right, that right. That does look very posed. Interesting. This one, some of the artwork is pixelated at the end, Vera I think. Cruz. Vera Cruz. I, think I, that I know someone cool. named Vera Cruz, but... I think that looks cool. Uh -uh. No, that looks pretty bad, Jason. This one, Ben Julie. You know, this reminds me of. It reminds me of that uh, racing game from the uh, brothers, uh, the Fragor brothers. Um, it does look like that. Uh, safari, snow safari. No, uh, Savannah Tales. Tales. Savannah, Savannah Tales. Tales. Yes. Yes. What happened to the Ragnar? I mean, not Ooh, the Fra Fragor. Be smart. <laughs> Hey, the good news is my kids have like a plethora of new games to pick from over here. That's true. The better is this the one with fifty-eight? No. Be smart. Oh, look at those adorable things. These are dogs. 
These are more dogs. He's got to go with something. Or something? Is this the one? No, where these are mice, dude. That's not a dog. <laughs> what is wrong with you? It's like, <laughs> these, these are, are dogs. dogs. Look at it. That's definitely, a mouse, man. Definitely not a dog. All right, let's glance at it. It was brown. I assume it was a dog. Oh, yeah, dogs are brown. Yeah, what the, is the happening? Thing you shot out of the toilet a few minutes ago is the dog, too. <laughs> I have to, yeah, you get the cat <laughs> girl. Uh, brown. Profiteers! This game is not even getting talked about. No, it's the guys who did Coup and. Oh, and, okay, hit it back then. It's Lameem. It's the ones who did Coup and, right. and all the other stuff. Oh, is it all right? Seriously, yeah, they do. Back. They got to make their games look better, though. They always get them reprinted by another company. They make a small print run. Oh, that's horrible. Bono. Yeah, he but he has... His games he are had, great. He, his, I remember Koo came in the same style box, the first mm -hmm. version. Koo has sold a gazillion copies, so you never know. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hell Token. Remote Control and Robot. Go Gooseberry. They were also Gooseberry. <laughs> Wait, Hell <laughs> what? It's actually a token. It's a token that's come to life. Hell Token? Hell Token. <laughs> what is this, dude? Hell Token? Okay. Come on, man. This is bizarre. That looks like it's based on, I don't a, know. on a manga or something. All right, here's a queenie for franchise, which we have, so that's good. I want to see Hell Token. Wow, that looks interesting. That all is random. Stuff. Franchise, which is the reprint of um, the one with the giant boots, Medieval Merchant. This is a, a mm -hmm. meeple for the Marshmallow Man and Ghostbusters, but what Ghostbusters game? One of them. One mm. of them. Speedy Pickers. Have we even seen this? Oh, Yummy Monsters. No, this is just a catalog. Never mind. <laughs> He's so fast, you can't see. This was the random stuff that got thrown in These the box. These are all the instructions. There's a lot of random stuff. All right. Keep For the games. All right. I feel like right, I'm back right. in Germany, baby. Rice Dice. Ratland. There's a Skylands, Queenie. There's almost as much content as uh, there is in Skylands in that one. Yes. Ratland. It almost looks like we got all the pieces for the game. We got the rats. Here's the... Uh, those, I party. think those rats are from This Rat is Land. the instructions for Monster Party. Well, whatever. We'll worry about that later. Sangia, add. Come keep on. Keep it coming. Keep it coming. This come is on. all the accessories. Give me something good. Oh, here's the uh, advertisement Give for Cleopatra and the Society of Architects. Good. The Queen is back. Oh, coming later. <laughs> all right. Back to games. Donning the purple. <laughs> you know, actually, I like this cup. I think that's a cool name, actually. Look at that guy. Oh, and the woman has a knife, too. Put that purple on. Uh, this guy has no friends. Is there anyone on his side? Yeah, the problem is they're all donning purple. white in that picture. No, he has the purple. Royalty wears a purple, Jason. Oh, oh. Oh, wait. It's a, oh, that looks more interesting. And in reverse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Sam, you wanted this so badly. You can have two copies. <laughs> no. So what happened was... We packed them both, because I saw one, I was like, oh, yeah, we already put the other one. Then I saw the other one, I was like, ah, yeah, we got that already. Oh, okay. Let's put it in the library. That's good, man. That's exciting. All right, prehistory. Huh. It's better than post-history. No, Z likes post-history. That's a lot of table space, dude. Yeah, it's it like two it massive, is. basically, boards, yeah. Mm -hmm. Two boards, yes. I'm interested in trying that, but wow, it's a lot of table space. It All looks right, interesting. Cool. It's a from A4 games. games. No, A plus games. No, it's just A, a games. It's A games. Airship City. Do you want to know more information about this game? Too bad. Redacted. <laughs> <laughs> Airship City. What company this is this? Japan brand. Uh, well, no, that's it's just a conglomeration. It doesn't mean anything. Something else. Wow, there's lots of these just cards. Ooh. All right, brains, family. This is, there is like a, a brains a puzzle. Is there kind a brain that's not family? Mm -hmm. Brains for adults. <laughs> yes. I don't know. Brains, the adult party game. <laughs> it's a Canadian game. Supposedly, it's some sort of like puzzle game. Why is it called it is brains? Nice. It's really nice. <laughs> because it's a series called Brains. Showtime. Uh, that looks cool. Soon to be sued. <laughs> yes. No, because it's what not. Is that? It's Showtime. It's not HBO. <laughs> <laughs> I think that one TV, looks cool. Actually. I like movie-themed games. I do too. So I'm hoping this is good. 
It's Pegasus Spiel. I just wonder if it's like a party game more than it is, you know, anything else. Yeah, but Pegasus Spiel is one of those companies that I'm almost, not 100% on, but like the very look. high percentage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's got a good look. All right. School Fair <coughs> Cafe Club. No. Oh, no, that's enough. But it's, a, but it's in a special shrink wrap. No, I can't. And this one didn't get crushed. You How many little shrink wrap? card packs did we put in this thing? Here's a pack of cards for you. Feast your eyes on. Fair Cafe Club. Right. Sailblazer, Rise of Ascendancy. I feel like we this one's crossed already. our yeah, deck yeah, already. Yeah, yeah. Have we played this one at all? Or is this it's one that just keeps crossing and crossing? There. It's sitting over there somewhere. Yeah. Whoa. Oh my goodness. What is, is that the thing That's you can't show because it's a gift? Yes. Don't look, kids. They better not be watching this anyway. <laughs> I'm just taking this home and giving it to them. So Harry oh. Potter, Hogwarts. Yeah, I hope you are. And well, Harry I Potter. Was. Did you get two of the same? I'll do it in two weeks. Did you get two of the same? <laughs> oh no, I that's know different. Why you have two paws. <laughs> <laughs> Murphy's Law. Yep. What? I'm confused. I'll explain yeah, later. All right. How many left? Is this the last box? About 80. And it's between not two kidding, boxes? I think it's about 80 games. Is anyone still watching this? <laughs> How many? 780. Good night! Wow. Also, there's, we have. There's a lot of people. There's some sick. <laughs> Y'all can't see that, but it's getting scary. Oh, we'll show them at the very end. If no, Jason what? buried under it. <laughs> the zombie attack. We're like, we're okay. We got it's a wall board games. I hope they're gamers. <laughs> It'll take a while to get through. Monkey Temple. D this is by the company. No, what I could use is a drink. This company did a game last year that we really yeah, liked. Me too. Here, can I, can you take this? This game. I wouldn't have done that. But, yeah. Wait, but where's all the snacks then? They're over here. Yeah, let's break out that Do box we, so we can kind of get some. Wait, there's only been three snacks. I know we got a whole box of snacks. Where are they? I mean, yeah, maybe they're under Kenny here. stole that box. He's got all the oh, snacks at his house already. We did ship like a whole box of snacks, didn't we? Yeah. They yeah. might have been just spread around, no? no. I think I they, they were, were used to putting went international on um, it. Yeah, it did. Oh. It was just a So spot this around, company no? did a game that we really I liked did. last year and I don't <laughs> I totally did. I don't remember what game they did, but they <laughs> did a I'm from everywhere. Space balloon <laughs> games. They did a game that we really liked last year. Uh, you mean uh Monkey What's uh, it called? Monkey Temple. Monkey Temple. But they did a game that we really liked last year. I don't remember what it was called. Kaga Temple. <laughs> no, it's cracking my temple. Alarm. You're ruining my caca alarm. Caca throne. Um, brides and brides. Name for that game. Oh, the Kaka game that Derek Kaka liked. Kaka brides yes. and brides. So yeah, they man. showed us or this one. The throne. All right, Detzilla. Uh, okay. Now I don't know. The game sounds. I mean, it has, definitely has that very anime-ish style artwork. De right? <laughs> wow. Okay. So it really is a Detzilla. Det's coming to get you, but don't fear. Batman will save you from debt. So this is very much a movie poster style. Titles across the top. Mm -hmm. Yes. You know, credits at the bottom. It's, I mean, it's a cool cover. I'll give him that. It's a really Tweet cool man. cover. Tweet wait, Man. Wait, wait, wait. Tweet Man. Tweet Man. Iron Girl. <laughs> debt Hulk. <laughs> Alibaba. The Oracle. And Lady Easy. Are all coming from <laughs> Deadzilla. Oh, yeah. Sorry, Sam. Wait, whoa. I'm a loser, baby. I know. It's Bruno Catala and Vincent so Detroit, and you were making fun of the name. Me. You were making fun of the name. I apologize. So <laughs> Let us see what kind of game loser is. A game for Z? I bet you you have to be a loser in the game to win. I'm a loser, yeah, maybe that's it. This looks like it might be a reprint of something, so why actually. Don't you kill me? Right. Did you ask? Did I asked one. <laughs> he, he, just, he just stuck it in his pile there. That's a pretty cover, but the the back doesn't look as exciting. The cover looks no, good. Oh, I heard some good things about this. Ooh. Oh, nice. There's a reprint of that? Yeah. Very nice. Yes. It's also coming back to America, too. A back of Spiel is bringing it. Yes. Also, the rules are somewhere in this pile. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Thank you, man. Hanbukan. Crazy Baobab. eggs. Okay, this is a weird... Okay, so look at this here. This is a game. Not lame. Is that just me reading that? It's a game, not lame. A game, not lame. What, does that, lame what does that mean? Game. <coughs> also, like isn't this isn't this from that game that Sheriff uh, came from? 
Oh yeah, you're one. right. Yeah, that was the ori in the original. Okay, whatever. Crossing the border or whatever it was called. Turin Market. You play a trader in turn and it's set collection and nothing else we know about it because we didn't bother to show you. Alright. Orang Rimba. Ooh, a bonus miniature. Turin Market. Of a okay, what do you think the miniature looks like, Sam? Uh, it's a, it's a... Oh, it's the same company. Oh, you can see it on the other side. Yeah. I would not have picked that to be the miniature for this cover. No. Well, there's a there's a thing on the front of the cover. That's sure. playing the evil people, I guess. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, do you know what it is? That's the like forest. the steamroller. No, 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 no. no. You forest. have to stop these people from coming in and taking the forest out with their bulldozer. And that evil miniature is, is the evil miniature. Look That's kind of cool. The evil miniature is the evil miniature, yeah. That's super helpful. You smirk. Hero Path. That's bad. That's a badly it done. empty. That's well, a badly done it? name. It does. Don't what? you think that's a bad font? I can't read it upside. Hero Path. Oh man. That's a bad font. You it's can't also read bad it. bad everything though. That cover looks ugly. It looks very. This guy looks old. realistic. It looks old. Yeah. Ah, uh, the game itself doesn't look too bad. Hero Path. Hero Path. With allies. Yes, with allies. Well, wait. Here's Hero Path. Fire and Fire light. Fire and light. No friends. <laughs> this is expansion, too. Wait. Yeah, these are expansions. A wait. Full base game. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. This cover is horrendous. This artwork is... There's Hero Path. Dragon <laughs> Roar! Coordinate. Whoa, this thing is heavy, and yeah, it doesn't look some bad. Cool, some cool minis. Did you see this one, Sam? At the fair? Not at the fair. I saw this, it was hall, this was Hall yeah. 6. Does it look interesting? I didn't really read that much. Or no, it was Hall uh, 8. Yeah, it looks good. It was that very bad. Remember you said, said hall go wasn't find open. stuff in the back hall? Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> that guy who came and gave it to you went back. Let's go find his booth. There was no booth. He, he wasn't here. This is the Grimoire. Grimoria. Grimoria. This is five factions. No, Grimoire. Grimoire. I don't. Ah, uh, here. Okay, so here's the problem with this artwork. It doesn't jive. I almost want to say that they took all these pictures here off the cards and then they slapped them into one picture. Like, look at them. They're not looking at each other. There's no interaction between the characters. Well, yeah, of course that's what they did. But well, I don't like when they do that. Well, get over it. It's the only beautiful. The really seems out of place is that creepy goat in the middle of it. No, you have to have a goat. <laughs> Everybody needs a goat. Bah. Welcome to the grim world where the path to a happy ending Fun is time daily says, with sup. corpses of your enemies. Hey! Ooh. So, mm -hmm. if I miss a, uh, one of those, let me, let me know. Corpses. I like the cover. All That's right. a good cover, yeah. I do like the cover. I just wish I knew if it's a card game, if it's a board game, you know what I mean? Played it. Galactic it's a two-player two game. Let's play this one. Let me see. Hold on. Yeah, played it. Reviewed it. A long time ago. Got that it. Was one of those, I brought that back with me. Maybe there's a new version of it. Or no, this looks good. <coughs> yeah, yeah, that looks good. Here you no, go. No, I actually picked this up at Essen. I don't know how you Sientia. got it. Sientia. Yeah, because Jason exists. I had a list. I got everything. That All was my right. goal. Sientia. Physics, chemistry, biology, and astronomy. Uh, Sientia. Like learning. <laughs> it no, does, cool. but it might be good. It's 30 minutes. But it's about learning. I like that cover a lot, by that's the way. Cool the cover. DNA? Yeah. That's a fantastic cover. It's just a double helix. Oh, Sciencia was the one that's double not... Double Heli. Yes, Sciencia is, it just is me? cool. It was this guy peeing with that facial expression. Into the plate? Like the... the no, 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 no. Look, look at his face. You uh, con. I don't think I make that face when I pee. <laughs> I wouldn't what's know. That, what's that plate called? Um, He's happy that he's peeing. I can't remember. Or panning for gold. Panning. Isn't there a name for that? Panning for gold? No, for the the plate they use. It's called for the that. pan. Oh, it's called the pan. Yeah. Oh my goodness! Is it? So it's is like it a big grid pan? here of things. Well, so much for that back. The front was kind of interesting. Oh, I'll oh. give it a try. I wonder. If... No, it's not a. Tremble, back. humans. <laughs> 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 I like the name of that one a lot. This like, is also. All right, that's cool. Smartphone Inks Company. Yeah, yeah. Though these guys are—they're like a new on the block. Oh my! Just open up Pandora's box. Yep. I like the look. Here, I'll shake them into place. 
Okay, this one I've heard about them though. This is the one that they're getting buzzed for besides smartphone. First, first contact. contact. First this contact? is a How many games did they come a out? A party with? game, but you are basically creating a language to, to talk to other people. Um, you're using it's it's Sounds very original. Okay. Yeah, basically you're participating and figuring out what this means and then using that as a clue to get words. Oh, really? I've heard very good things about this one, but hardly anyone's talking about it because their well, games haven't hit America. Because it's yet. hard to talk about. And you need to figure out how to well, talk. Well, the game is, uh, and also, <laughs> Hagar. Man, I can't remember the last time I've read a Hagar cartoon. That, that's yeah. part of the beer beer coaster series. So we got Popeye and Hagar. So far, you've done well. Those are two <laughs> that amuse me. Okay, first Tour contact operator. is good. Oh, Tour that looks interesting. Tour operator. Uh, 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 uh. Yeah, it does look pretty it good. It was a tour operator. This is like so oh, yeah, fascinating. Went to a different thing. Like of every so game we talked about today, about there's too. almost none that are like in the hotness list. You know, it, it's no, but this looks cool. It, and is there a cruise ship in it? That would be even cooler. Fate shifters. You know, oh, they here do. Here we go. They shift. They shift fate. Is that what that is? Wow, that's pretty. How did you know that? He was guessing. It says it right there. I was curious what they were for. Oh my goodness! Can you you can read that? All right. Yeah, easily. And my eyesight well, is very good. Tell me what that says close. then. No. Because right. I can't read that language. Fate shifters. Don't do it, Tom. Hmm. No. Okay, that's okay. That's what I'm doing. He's just stuffing I was gonna, it If in you there. had gripped even an inch more than that. All right, itchy monkey. A, bo a battle of lice. Infringement. Yes. Oh, somebody's getting sued. <laughs> Somebody is getting sued. <laughs> it's Itchy Monkey is a game about monkeys and lice. Spawn and jump, spawn and bump. <laughs> Co hmm. Colonize monkeys, increase your numbers, and outsmart your opponents. But beware at every move because no one likes nitpicking. Ah. Mm. I get it. I get it. My wife thinks nitpicking, I think, is like in our least top five least things in the world to do. She hates it. Easy to win, but hard to master. So now there's two games about lice. What's the other one? All right. Lice shower? Wonder Zoo. This is Uwe Rosenberg for kids. It's probably not Uwe Rosenberg, but it sure looks like he designed this game, doesn't it? Yeah. Nice. <laughs> Somebody else is getting sued. Oh. <laughs> Dude, that looks pretty cool, though. That looks nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wonder Zoo, it does and look cool. I bet cool. it's like real nice and chunky pieces, you Inside know? Justin O. Or else just inside, I'm not sure. <laughs> Wait, inside Justin O? No, he's a designer. I like Justin O's stuff, though. Yes. What is this? Let's choose a question to ask. Listen to the stories. Read the mind of the storyteller. This sure sounds Dixit-ish to me. Yeah, yeah, right. There's been a lot of these kinds of games lately. All right, Hug Justin Mom o Hug. Justin is sort of all over the His place. His companies are Jemblo and Hug Mom Hug. Yeah. Hugger, and then one more time. That is the second last box, I believe. Is my a nice cover, I have that? to say, on that box. Where are my snacks? Yeah, they did not make the snacks didn't make it up here on the top of the day right now. Oh, you are? <laughs> they kept our snacks? No, we didn't put the Ice HQ on it, so they didn't get Well, they better not eat our <laughs> snacks, I'm just saying. <laughs> That's I it. I will find there, them. There's people in the in I have a very master. special set of skills. They involve eating snacks. How many games are in this box, them. Kenny? 58, according to Kenny. 56, 56 sorry. So basically, Quartermaster Logistics is having a good warehouse party. Do you want to be the richest party. rascal? I think we have that, right? I richest rascal. All right, well, let's do... Uh, Dragon quick. Rush the card game. Clickbait. Watch this video. <laughs> Number 17 will shock you. Clickbait. Uh, okay, why is it an arrow? Who makes games in arrow-shaped boxes? It's called clickbait. Okay, so you know what this game is, really? It's because you are... You roll dice, and then you got to make a advertisement using those as the first letter of the words. Got it. Sure. Okay. It's cool box. one of the categories, kind of, of... Um, Guess what, Tom? We hit the next level. Oh, 90,000? Yay! Thank you, everybody! Spielworks. North American Railways. It's Spielworks. It's 45 minutes. I can handle that. Is it from Pierce Sylvester? Yeah, okay. Even though this was redone, actually. This is the redo by Jumping Flying Lemur. Jump in here anytime you want to. I'm waiting for something that looks interesting. 
Actually, this looks pretty neat. Tauntaun. Dong, dong. It's a trick game. Look at the cards. Dong, dong, dong. Mm -hmm. I saw it there. Um, it is magnetic. Yes. The cards are magnetic? No, cat. The box. No. <laughs> and they are little skinny cards. Do I look like a cat? This was, this was, this seems cool. And it's Tauntaun. All right, City Explorer. This I don't think is playable for us, well, right? Then, then do eat. I guess. Did you see that? Wait. What's going on? How did we get more than one Dewey? So the reason we got another Dewey. one of these. <laughs> oh, okay. Baby. This is when people came to our booth and gave us stuff. Beaver after Clan. Our man's a Beaver Clan. No, not Beaver Clan. Okay. Anything uh, with Beaver in it is just bad. No, I don't think so. Okay, this game will last for several months. What it's do you a mean? selfie cards. You give them someone like, take a picture doing this. The selfie doing this. It's one of those oh, things. Oh, okay. Papering duel. Who can wallpaper the bedroom faster? Yeah! That sounds cool. It's Mondu. I challenge you, fool, to a papering duel. And a move. <laughs> bam, bam, race. I'm sorry. This is random <laughs> words now. Oh, this... That's been getting some attention. Oh, is it a lookout game? Yes, it's a That's lookout game. That's been getting some love. I got every lookout game except for the choo Caverna choo. expansion. Hey, here's Aikido. Imperious Empire of the Dawn. What is coming out? Take a pig. Peep mask. Oh, take a pig. Take a pig. <laughs> take a pig. Help yourself. Take a pig. Okay. Who did it? I've already played this game. I've seen, I feel like I've seen this it's also. It's a different cover. Oh. It was that, no, this is the one that was in the poop thing. It's a game. This game about farting. No, it ain't, it's not about farting. <gasps> what is it about? A caca. Oh. Who did it? This one's called Four Pints, Please. Oh, I'm excited about this actually. Is it a trick taking game? I forget what it was, but I looked gorgeous, and I, I actually was. You mind if I grab it? I don't mind. War Room Wars. Making dishes up for customers. Four yeah, this pints, is the please. one I was thinking about. Oh, this one has the word Vassal in it! You have Samurai to take it. Vassal! Samurai um, Vassal, the card game. Warunga You're interested in that one? Oh, uh, not if it's got Vassal in it. No, 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 no. Right. Okay. This looks cool. This There's looks something good. wrong with this one. It's Ain't called it? Mana Clash, but it says 11.9 euros on this. Pretty sure we've already, already played this game and reviewed it. What is it? 11.9 euros. I haven't. Because I remember talking about Vassal. Well, Room Wars is food. Okay, it's a food game. That's cool. Gift party. We saw this already. Yeah, already <laughs> How did some of these get Aquatico. in here Aquatico. That's a cool name. Aquatico. Ah, Mayfly. This is a... Uh, where did I see this game from? This looks nice. Oh, yeah. This is the one they're going to get sued by the country of Jamaica. Cool running. Cool. <laughs> Feel the rhythm. Feel, Feel the ride. The ride. Get up, man! It's, it's boxing time! time. <laughs> the guy who was taking me around the tour of Jamaica it's, told me they were going back and they were going to win, and I was like, I, I believe you. <laughs> I've seen the movie. No, they didn't win. No, he meant the next one. This is cool. Foot Peak Medieval. Wow, that's bad art. Now that box is the book. This is like an old uh, VHS the festivals. Box, isn't it? It's a little for VHS. Doppelganger. Doppelganger. Where it's its twin. I think. I think we're breaking a world record here. Like Guinness Book of World Record for most games brought out of boxes. That's not a on a live video. Shut up. <laughs> we could make one. Why don't you then web we bell? Will. <laughs> Plus, I plus. Bell. <laughs> Venture Angels. Oh, this one actually looks interesting. I like the. That's some cool looking pieces. With Bell. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I saw Venture this. Venture Angels? Yeah. That's Mondu again. Oh, well, I like Mondu. No, Mondu I think that cool. game looks great. Cauldron that Master. Cool. That, that sounds cool. Cauldron Master? Yeah. I think we've seen this before. It's Maybe Fight Duty. Don't get caught! What? What is that dude? That dude with Oh, this is by Big Potato. You just gotta get people to do things. It's one of those games. Make a player yawn. This is the one that we played. Remember when Kenny was being all smiley and mischievous the whole mischievous. night? 
This and that's remember that night too. we had the cards. Yeah, what was that that we were doing? This is that so was don't get got. That was their mini pack. Okay, don't get got. Okay. Remember, and we were like, wait. So you had them, Kenny? Did you have some too? Yeah, yeah, Kenny was trying to get somebody to like open their wallet or take something from your hand. Yeah, he kept saying, "What is this?" <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, it was like really like in your face, right? Don't get got. <laughs> don't get got. That's Kenny's game, basically. Alice. It's Alice. Alice. Alice in Wonderland game. There's a lot of games in button. It's the new book thing. Alf outfits now. Well, no, this is part of that book series. This is the new. It is. That looks like I a prototype. Then, I, I no, I believe this was part of the book series. I think. Vita Moore. I believe we've already seen yeah, that one. Yellow ah! stuff Iron oh, clay. Oh, that's beautiful. That's gorgeous. Wait, are these counters? No, this is tokens. I think. Oh, okay, we got to open this one and look. I think you got that. Uh, just it's like money, basically, for games. I don't care. I don't remember seeing them. There, are they clay? That's if they're beautiful. real clay ones, they're awesome. Clay poker chips are amazing. Other don't side. break. Other side, other side, other side. I'm not going to... What don't do you think? It's going to rip the box off? Don't break it, though. Are they actual clay? You're breaking it. <laughs> You're a pain in the butt. I know. I'm sorry. <laughs> Look at this box, man. Huh? Jeez, it's nice. Okay, all I have to say is... 18x money right there. Oh yeah, that's what we were all. Thinking. Yeah, we're all thinking 18x <laughs> money. Why in the world yeah. would you waste that money on a game of 18xx? Those are nice. Ah, oh, these are really nice. I don't know if there's enough here though for a lot of games. Yeah, right. 18X, that's, what I'm saying. that's an that's 18x what I'm thinking bank too. This is a gorgeous set of poker chips though. Yeah, these are really. These are. I mean, they're not poker chips. I guess they could be, but they're you know. Yeah, this is Coins super high quality. Coins or money for whatever. I also like that it has this case and that oh, box. Oh, man, look at this. This is a quality of... Uh, yeah, leave the ribbon in so I can get them out. I know I was trying to... You pulled the box so away. You definitely used the ribbon to get it out the first Shut time. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> truly got you. I need to check these out. I love clay poker chips. All right, stories from Amigo. Oh, these are super nice. Hey, it's the new Muse. Awakenings? Awakenings. Is this part two? This is just two. That's right? part two. I think it's a standalone. Uh, co -op, uh, so you can mix it more. It's, sure. it's a nice cover. Flash oh, juice. Mm. <gasps> Flash. Oh, uh, juice. Diggers. You've got to drink it all. Shibuya. Shibuya. Okay, it's just a random. Now we're just saying words. Kimono. Dragon. Concerto. This is a Concerto sounds cool. Uh, yes. This dungeon duel, we definitely have already seen that one. Yes. The Era of Voyage Discovery. Ooh. Already done it. Stocktastic! That's a good one. That is stocktacular. Think about it. Halloween Party! Oh, M for SS4, Sam, here you go. I already, I already reviewed it. Castle oh. Rampage! I just assumed that. I don't even. Wait, is this based on that video game? It looks like that dude from that video game. Yeah, I, I don't think it is, though. It is not, yeah. Which one? Matthias Kramer. No, this Castle is in German, I think. Oh, Rampage? Okay, no, not Castle Rampage. It's something else. New Corp Order Deluxe. That's for the Peak Oil game. Oh, this is an expansion for Peak Oil? Or I is believe it a, so. I'm not sure. It doesn't say doesn't expansion. Say okay, then maybe it's a different game that's in the Peak Oil Thank series. You know, marketing and manipulation from Two Tomatoes. Cool cover. Perfect Hotel. Oh, yeah, this I, it's open because I opened it there. I was thinking about bringing it. But that's perfect. This is the game yeah, system, the green that. box of games. We've seen this before. I think we yes. saw it there and looked at it. Imperious. Now we saw an expansion to this a little earlier, right? A little yes, box. A little this is box. from Grant Rodiak. It's probably good. And then this one, Heckmeck Deluxe. That's kind of cool. Heckmeck. Oh. Jeez, that didn't got to be. All right, well. Let's show it, man. Look, publishers of tins. <laughs> Feel the wrath! Well, I don't think the boxes did much yeah. better it's, on this it's trip. A, it's a Kinesia game. It's probably just a redo anyway. That's nice, though. I don't think this is like one of those games that does not need an expansion or a, a deluxe version. But, it's good. <laughs> Here's the thing, though. 
this is exciting. There's a lot of interesting. You that one down there? <laughs> nope. There's a lot of interesting games in this pile, but I do think we did a pretty good job of bringing back the rest in our in the best in our suitcases. I think no, so. yeah. But one yeah. we're most excited about anyway. Yeah, these there might might be here some that are fantastic, but the ones we were really excited about did come. Yeah. Back. Nah, you can put Roy in the shot. What do we care? This this uh. Nah, nah. What? Nah, he's okay. in it. Pan back, pan back. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Take us out of the shot. Just let people look at the games. All right, so the that's everything games. we opened. That's a lot of games. Now listen, we're really glad of these games. The chance of us reviewing all these in the next couple of weeks is equal to zero. <laughs> Correct. The chance of us reviewing all these, period, is probably zero. That's probably true. But there's a lot of interesting ones in there that we'll try to grab out ones that look interesting and play them as quickly as we can and, and get through. There's some of them in there that aren't actually for review. They're for the library. For the oh, yeah, yeah. Library. There's some of that, too, sure, right? Sure. The food also. The snacks. What snacks? The two boxes are tasty to send. <laughs> there's some <laughs> snacks there. Are we going to do an unboxing of that, too? Yeah, right. <laughs> Snack unboxing special edition. All righty. Are well, we done? Was that it? That is that. Is that. So... Folks, we appreciate you sticking around. That was three hours and 24 minutes. Do you feel yes. tired from doing it? Yeah, yeah. Alrighty. We'll see you back. Do a bit, maybe a little bit of live gaming tomorrow. Me and Z might do some of these two-player things. Okay, that sounds good. Because I think uh, Sam and Kenny are bringing back the library. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. Thanks, to everyone, for backing our Kickstarter. We appreciate yeah. it. Uh, it's at 91,000... 90... 2,000. No one back down to 91 and a half. Why does it keep doing that? It goes up and then down. It's, it's like tricksy. Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> so maybe we'll fund. That would be exciting. Uh, but so far, it's a good start. We appreciate everyone. We'll see you next time. Until then, I'm Tom Vassell. I'm Z Garcia. Thanks, everybody. Sam Healy. And special guest, Jason Levine. You know, the call gaming yourself machine. Just, just say Jason Levine. No, man. Special guest, Jason Levine. Special guest. Machine. Adios. Thanks so much for watching the Dice Tower videos. Find more great videos and reviews as well as our top-rated audio podcast at Dicetower.com. You can also find other great shows at Dicetowernetwork.com. I'm Eric Summerer, and you've been watching the Dice Tower. The Dice Tower is sponsored by Cool Stuff, Inc., where you can find great games for great prices. Cool Stuff, in stock. Check them out at CoolStuffInc.com.